Beep boop. There's an all hell. Yeah. Hope you see first. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Aislinn, how are you doing today? Sorry about that, I guess I was muted. <laughs> how are you doing today? I'm doing great, actually. The uh, marathon stream for today has been doing pretty well. Had a nice collab, had a very comfy collab with Mai. I was playing some guilty memes with Cosmo and Lenarth. Uh, Cosmo's internet is kind of messing up. Uh, I'm going to see if he's still interested in playing some more video games. Oh, let's check my internet before. Yep. If you're free, Aislinn, you're more than welcome to play Strive with us. <laughs> the stream's been going for 6 hours and 55 minutes so far. Wow, 8 hours. A full workday's worth of uh, streaming goes by pretty fast, doesn't it? Let's hop back into Strive. A little bit hot in my room, but thankfully outside, it's only around, it's around 40, 50 degrees, right? Just fairly cold. It's fall, fall weather. Thank God, too, because yesterday it was 80 degrees, which is summer weather here. It, there's this massive rainstorm Guilty and a uh, wind thing with Jigger that happened yesterday, so that's part of the reason why it cooled down so fast. All right, I need to give Cosmo control. Do I do that again? I have to relearn how to do such basic things in Discord nowadays. Do it, 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 do it,
Cute, cute, cute. One of our consultants turned their office into a mini golf course each year. Went to that yesterday. Lots of free drinks were had. Much mini golfing was done. Sounds like you had a fun time. <laughs> That's actually kind of cool, though, turning your office into a mini golf course. I remember doing fun shit like that around the office. Used to do a lot of Christmas decorating myself. And it's an engineering consultant, so they got freaking crazy with some of the holes. Oh my god. Those people are always fun to hang out with. Do, 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 do. Do, do. Do, 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 do. Guilty Gear Strive. By too much blue. <laughs> uh oh if i turn off my turn on my controller that's kind of important right that that might just be a little bit important chap just a little bit Arrive. Who goes there? His eye. Never fear, Cosmo Bergamot's here. That's glorious. Can you do that again, please? <laughs> <laughs> Are you asking so so that you can clip it or something? Because I am not the correct Cosmo for singing. <laughs> uh, perhaps. Actually, I cannot be arsed to log into Twitch on a web browser to do such a thing, so... <laughs> New challenger approaches. I just noticed that someone... I also just noticed that someone in a chat earlier, around two hours ago, wrote, Give Minnie Faust a DP, please. <laughs> Shit. Oh, I totally I... missed that the first time. My dear familiar seems to be on the bark, so we're just going to close up the door such that familiar does not bother the stream. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now then, uh, can I have that, that uh, room code again? Yep, I need to make a new room anyway, so let me do that, and then I'll give oh. y'all both the room codes. The room codes. <laughs> Welcome back to a stage of destiny. Welcome. The wheel of fate is turning. Rebel one. <laughs> uh, let's see. I really wish that there was more that we would get to play Soul Calibur sometime in the VTubing fighting game community, but it never gets enough votes. The room code is now W I S A eight H A. There's whiskey indigo Sierra. 8 Hotel Alpha. I have already arrived. Excellent. <laughs> it begins. Mm -hmm. I say this like it hasn't already begun, but uh, we're going <laughs> to switch out of Eno because that was a bad choice. <laughs> Lenarth, are you going to be joining us? Yeah. I'm um, just finishing the match and I will be on my way to get okay. spawned. Take your time. <laughs> For anyone currently watching, once again, if you would like to play the Strives, if you would like to, if you, if you strive to play the Strives with us, 
uh, feel free to pop by the room code. You do not need to be in Discord to do so. It's been a fairly pleasant day, all things considered. Yeah, it Not seems like you have been doing exceptionally well. Mm-hmm. No, I'm gonna play a different character for a little bit. Yeah, I take advantage of these skins that I installed after all. <laughs> Which one of these colorations did I use again? Was I fond of? Uh, let me see. I'm sorry, did you make Bridget into a cat girl? I may or may not have done something to Bridget. <clears throat> <laughs> let us let us leave your extracurricular activities out. <laughs> um, oh, I wasn't even implying that. What are you thinking? <laughs> you yourself said you may have done something to her. Yes, such as giving them a nice costume and just in time for the holidays. <laughs> Excellent. Perhaps. A meat outfit. I've only installed. Can you imagine? Uh, Bridget and Faust have a canon interaction somewhere where Bridget comes up and is like, Hey, can I help out? Or can I get some help? And Faust is like, new bottom surgery dropped. Push the stick that pushes <laughs> back and feel your pain. And here's one that the most I'm going to pull out of says, Kill your friends guilt-free. Kill your friends guilt-free. <laughs> I need to inst- Oh my god! He even says replace everything. <laughs> that's horrible. That's 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 fucking horrible. I've not, Amazing. I've not played brisket in a long time, so I'm probably gonna suck. Oh wait, she's basically just uh, heavy slash, heavy slash. So basically me, more or less. I actually don't even remember how to do any of their specials, so this can be fun. This can be interesting. Wait, she's just uh, she's just uh, half circles, I believe. Yep, it's just half circles. Okay. Excellent. Oh wow, Faust, why are you so slow on that upkeep? <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Ow. Yeah, ouch. Oh no. Brisket's kinda disgusting in Strive, what with the whole combination rush down zoner. A rush zoner. Yeah, that seems pretty wild. Mm -hmm. But just like other smalls, they have very little health anyway, so... Yeah, well... Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if if Faust counts as a small or not on account of how skinny he is. Kill your friends. <laughs> Kill free. uh, I thought I would be able to block low on that one, I guess not. Let's see, uh... Let's see, uh... Okay, to do that, and I don't remember how to use that, so my bad. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember how to play brisket at all. Rip. So hang on, that that sort of indicates that Bridget is played kind of like how Testament used to be, by putting out traps and such with the yo-yo. She like puts out the traps, and then she can choose to uh, pull to fly along it or to not. Interesting. Unfortunately, um. I generally find that people, a lot of brisket players forget that they can stop midair when they do that. So they do that only to run straight into my heavy slash. <laughs> Much, And just like how I never seem to learn from doing a da air dash heavy slash and getting punished with an anti-air, uh, many briskets do not learn how to use the brakes. <laughs> so it just becomes a recurring event. Oh, excellent, very good. That worked out well. So it's not... Uh... Ah! Mm -hmm. Wow, okay. Let's get completely ah! stomped on right now. Ow, ow, ow. Ow. Ah, I there love that little thing. That's, like, my favorite part of Faust. I get caught by that thing all the time. Like, no cap. Oh shit, no! <laughs> oh shit! Oh! It's like the one combo that I can actually do. What the <laughs> face was that? 
I'm not sure if you noticed also, but uh, when you initially did it, her yo-yo fell on top of her, and she made this awesome. She made such a face when that happened. It's like ah. <laughs> Kill your friends. Oh man. A long, long time ago, I had a friend who cosplayed Bridget, mm -hmm. and she made this yo-yo that was—it had like a one of the retractable dog leashes in it. Mm -hmm. So it had like very cool capabilities on that one that was turned out really, really interesting. Oh, but interesting. But now, like, I talked to her recently, and she's like, "Yeah, they made a new Bridget costume, and now I have to do all of this extra business," and like. <laughs> I'm contractually required to be Bridget again. <laughs> I hope they have fun with it. She was a really good Bridget cosplayer back in the day, back when it was still like accent core. Mm -hmm. How Not, that again. Work? Not again! Not again! Not again! <laughs> Brisket will not have any shins by the end of this match. That's impossible! To be, honest, to be fair, I didn't know you could do it from there either. Like, you uh, you were so high up in the air, I did not think that I was... I had a hitbox that big. Me neither. It's kind of wild, honestly. Oper Operation success. Let me... Uh, do some quick here. I hope it's just pressure in my left ear. Uh, it's probably just from my headphones. Yeah, it's just wild that you have physical sensation these days. <laughs> push the stick that pushes back and feel your pain. And Imagine being physical. Muscle. Couldn't be me. <laughs> I do not have. A, I am not a bag of carbon atoms. Yet. <laughs> I mean, we can work on it. Some, I'm sure Faust would be able to help. <laughs> I'm not sure if he has a doctorate in, com in computer science. <laughs> I really want to hit with uh, Buck bounce. The, the quarter circle forward hard slash that Faust has got. The the this, not that one. <laughs> that thing? Because mm -hmm. I want to see what the, the hairstyle that Ow. comes up for Bridget is. Um, oh, I know what you're talking about now. The thing where... Ha! Ah! Okay, so it's, it's not as... It's not that big. But it is big. Mm-hmm. Oh, all right. <laughs> Kill your friends. Guilt free. Ah. Let's see you now. What did? What was the move that they did? No, it's not that one. It's not that one for sure. So, <laughs> yeah, I can't. I don't. I definitely don't remember how to play Brisket at all, because does she has a lot of stuff like. Uh, wake up DP is her wake up DP is actually fucking nasty. I'm not gonna lie. Mm -hmm. And if you're as small brained as I am, you'll always fall for her wake up DP. No, or that, <laughs> or I can just lose my shins again. <laughs> you don't need shins. Yeah, who even needs you? What is that face? <laughs> it is certainly a face. Faces were had. Oh wow. <laughs> First thing is first. Mm -hmm. See you now. I keep trying to do the same thing and it isn't working. And what I'm is trying, happening here? I'm trying to... That was totally not a DP I just tried to do. But I... Nah. I'm just spitballing here. I, le I legitimately don't remember anything except for those... Except for what you've seen. Fair enough. Ah! What? Oh yeah, um, that stuff hits Faust too, apparently. Oh, butt bounce! Uh, oh, yeah, this is gonna do it, I bet. Ow! Oh, man, You're right, that, that was, was what did it. <laughs> are too close for comfort. Excellent, that was a good shot. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm surprised that I was able to be successful in that manner. <laughs> Lenarth, you're up. Wonder. Alright. To... I will spectate and provide live commentary. Obs. Oh, wait, what? Oh. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. Oh, you'll be fine. Time. You'll be fine. No, he's playing Chip. Lenarth, you're gonna be so much faster than me. It will not be fair. <laughs> oh, trust me. Last time I played, I played against someone going for Faust as well, and I got utterly smacked. Sure, but that person probably knew what they were doing. Push the stick that pushes back. <laughs> Do you think I know what I'm doing? And here's one that the most uh, of the you says, are like twice the level that I am right now, so you must know at least friends, something. Yeah, I know which game I'm playing. <laughs> right? That must be something. Like, I, we really got to figure out what actually happened to Faust friends, between games. No idea. Um. They're still, they're still doing plastic surgery on people, I guess? Willingly or unwillingly? Ooh, ouch. What I'm curious about is, who designed these maps and what story relevance do they have? I really want to know what's with all these little boxes they wear that have these uh, cool little... Um, oh, oh, oh. Little uh, Wait, dioramas, I think is what they're called. Yeah, dioramas. There has, I mean, the the whole world is like crazy weird, extra technology now because of stuff with the gears from like a couple games ago. That's which true. Is they, something. They all have a uh, magic tech now, right? Something like that. I don't know if it's that everyone has it, but like the United States certainly does. Mm hmm. Like, I also never really understood where, what country Kai Kiske is supposed to be the, uh, king of, or whatever. Um... Quote unquote France. Like, totally not France, we promise. Is that seriously what it is? It's supposed to be France? Something like that, yeah. It, it's like the, the equivalent thereof. Okay, because it's definitely not France. It's definitely not England, for sure. No. Kai is supposed to be French. Oh, okay. Uh, French, question mark. I guess that makes sense when you consider that all the knights, all the original knightly stories and stuff were not British in origin, but were in fact French in origin. suppose it does make sense. Mm -hmm. What? What? Come on. Wait, Get if that's the, the case, then what country is Chip from, and what's, or what's he the president of? Chip is, uh... Chip was, he's a weeaboo, right? Like, he's yeah. like, sheesh, that does not work out well for me. He's a weeaboo, but he's definitely not oh, Japanese. No. Oh my god! And no, there goes Chip uh, Shins. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember where Chip is supposed to be from, but I think it was supposed to be, like, Neo America, Guilty Gear America. Guilty America? Guilt America, so, you know, normal America. <laughs> uh, but if that's the... So he's the president of the United States then. But that means... Yeah. Wait. Does that mean that Geo is his... Uh, that he's Geo's boss? Or... I don't know. It's the guilty lore is not meant to be taken seriously or internally for that matter, but... It's still... All fighting games. <laughs> there is not a fighting game available that, like, you can you can actually look at and make sense of, of any of it. Guilty Gear is messed up. Street Fighter is probably the least messed up, but, mm -hmm. like, still messed up. Friggin' push the stick that pushes Melty Blood, ridiculous. Oh, Melty Blood's all over the place. And then there's Tekken. Tekken is the game that's like, oh, this is a serious business martial arts game. And then it's like, mega corporations throwing mega corp- or throwing- It's like mega- well, at least Tekken 7 was very mega corp versus mega corp style. Um, I don't know. It's all- it's also over the pla oh, all over the place, fuck it. I'll just say- it's just all over the place. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot going on. The best fighting game. <laughs> What's the best fighting game? Dead or Alive. Oh, Dead or Alive, yes. Dead or Alive Beach Volleyball, yeah. <laughs> uh, based. Ow. Life. 
I did wonder if Chip was the president of an America, if not America, then Americanish country because there's this meme going around. The Washington Post recently did a extremely, a completely serious news article uh, about how the top chip and the chip that's one of the top guilty player gear players in the world is a chip main who goes by the handle Joe Biden. And not only that, oh, but they yeah. apparently have played as Joe Biden way before Strive. Kill your friends. So it's I'm like, I still can't believe that was an, a legit Washington Post article, but eh, what can you expect from the Washington Post these days? But, yeah, w WAPO is some weird stuff. Yeah. It just seems, I don't know, I don't... Speaking of a lot of bias as a former journalist myself, it, there's a lot of stuff these days that it's just not newsworthy. Guilty Gear is newsworthy, though. Like, I would very much like to learn that, you know, uh, current President Joseph Biden actually plays Guilty Gear, like, a lot. That'd be wild if he, if on his off time, he played Guilty Memes. No one would ever know, either. Honest. Well, and, like... You know, like, we had, in the past, we had, like, uh, Bill Clinton played the saxophone. Like, that was his whole thing. Really? And I didn't that know was that. an intri- Yep, Bill Clinton played the saxophone, and he was good at it, apparently. Oh. Huh. So... I guess that's sort of like you know. how, uh... What's his face? George Bush, after leaving the presidency, he pretty much just does paintings, uh, still life paintings now, of his dogs and whatnot. Just kind of wholesome. Yeah, if it weren't for the fact that they were coming from a person like him, I think they would be more <laughs> popular too, because they're not. That is you true. Know, they're not like high art, but they're not good. Yeah, they're just um, maybe they're I guess except of acceptable quality. I say this is someone who's not like an artist or anything. Oh gosh. Okay. I don't know how to play Testament. Apparently, Testament plays completely differently from how he has ever they how how they have ever played before. Because Testament used to be all about like putting out traps. You could put out like five or six different traps, mm -hmm. and if the opposing person touched them, you could do a bunch of stuff with them and all that. But I guess he's not like that anymore. And feel your pain. Uh, and here's one that the most unbelievable if anything, this current itineration of Testament kind of feels like Jill from Marvel vs. Capcom. They just. Throw out nothing but projectiles all over the fucking place. Oh no! Your poor little fairy. Mm -hmm. Kill your friends. Oh, they'll be fine, Kill I'm sure. <laughs> see what? Oh, okay. Yeah. See, as you can see, it's just nothing but nothing but projectiles. And well, it's sick. I refuse to see any of it. Let's let's be honest there. Ah. This is actually my first time playing Testament, I think, but huh. they're cool. I wanted to, to see what it would be like playing a te uh, playing as Testament, as opposed to being schooled by Testament. I cosplayed as Testament a long time back. Ooh. One of the old Testament ah. costumes, not this new. No! No, this new- what? I th you thought you blocked that. I thought I did too. Is this un- <laughs> <laughs> is, that an is that unblockable? I know, I, I don't think it's unblockable, I'm pretty sure it should be possible to block Show that, I just don't, I have no yes. idea what's going on anymore, oh my god, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> Everywhere I look, it seems like every other VTuber plays Strive, like, when I was collabing with Mai earlier this morning, um, video games somehow, or fighting games somehow came up, and she just casually mentioned that, yeah, she used to play a lot of Zard, and she also plays Strive herself. And I'm like, wait, really? God, everyone plays Strive. Well, it's, you know, Guilty Gear is the popular anime fighting game right now, so... That's true. Because but... Blaze Blue isn't really doing anything new right now. Mm-hmm. Not to mention, Blaze I think... Blaze Blue isn't really doing anything new. The creative director also left, so Blaze Blue also left, if I recall correctly, or moved on or something. Oh, interesting. Mm. I know that uh, Arc System Works has been having some kind of weird restructures or something going on. You do? Are we doing this, Lenarth? Sure. I'm gonna play... I'm gonna pick you this time. I'll play after y'all's match. 
Excellent. What color am I going to use for Geo, though? Use hot pink. Very important. <laughs> uh, wait for an opponent. Spectate while watching. Like, Faust really seems like he's gotten more dead. And I mean, like, we already have a dead guy, so it can't be Faust. Geo is yet another character I don't actually know how to play. The only characters I have ever played with anything approaching seriousness have been May and Brisket, so this would be interesting. But Geo is another rush down a gri or gorilla style character, so I should be able to just uh, find a way, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. Thank you for the hydrate redeem, Vimboy. How you doing? Welcome back. Oh! Ah, okay, so you can block it. That's good to know. Thank you for the gamer pride and the head pat. At least my, my knees weren't broken this time. <laughs> My legs are okay. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Hmm. Ah, my my <laughs> startup Damn. for all of these moves takes so long. Missed it. Excellent. <laughs> ben boy, are you still waiting for Strive to go on sale? I mean, you're welcome to hang out with us in voice chat if you so wish. What? Regardless, regardless if you have the game or not. Whew. All right, that's fair. That Before was that was a good that was a good one. Oh, you just woke up. Well, good morning, Ben boy. Wiki wiki. <laughs> wow, come on. I don't think I understand like what yeah, the priority is for doing counters. Counter. Yeah, I mean uh, uh, that 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 hitbox was very weird. I think counter I think it's like heavy certain heavy attacks are what caused the counter thing to pop up. It's not necessarily a counter. That's why you're able to have counter, 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 counter. It's not so much that you're countering a move, it's that you're hitting the other person with a heavy strike or something. Like, heavy slash always causes a counter thing with Jigger. Oh, oh boy, ouch. Oh, oh, ouch. Also bad. Exceptionally bad. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that was, that was exceptional. Good job on that beatdown. <laughs> Thanks. I don't even believe myself right now. <laughs> believe in the me who believes in you. I believe in in nothing about myself on account of I very rarely actually exist. Metal Hellsinger is on sale? What's Metal Hellsinger? Oh, Sounds like one of the other game. Jack Black games. <laughs> Sounds like a metal game. Get it? Metal. Uh, 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 it's an FPS rhythm game? Oh, that's interesting. Oh, it's that one. It's the one that kind of looks like Doom. Wait, so... Oh, oh that back. one. The one we plays of Valkyrie, yeah. right? And here's one that's Something like that, I think. Oh, no, yeah. that's, that's BPM. That's BPM you're thinking about. That's not the same. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's, it's doomed to the beat. It's doomed to the beat of metal? Interesting. So it's not BPM then that I'm thinking of. Ow. Yeah, you can tell uh, right off the bat that I have no idea how to play Geo whatsoever. <laughs> yeah, it seems to be pretty acrobatic and almost as fast as Chip, at least. Mm -hmm. She is uh, supposed to be a rushdown character also. Rushdown characters tend to have a lot of shoryus. Mm -hmm. Ow. I also noticed that she has a dash as opposed to... She has like a short, a short, a uh, short, uh, which we call it. Opposed to a run, yeah. Mm -hmm. Kill your friends. It's doomed to be the funny AS. 
I see. Up. Up. Oh, she has very. She doesn't do much with her punches, does she? I guess she is more. She is more of a uh, kicky, kicking character. Yeah. She definitely feels a little bit like Jury from Street Fighter. Mm hmm Yeah. Very like, uh, high Taekwondo. I thought that too, that she w once, when before Stripe came out, I assumed that Gio was a Taekwondo character as well. But then I found out she's actually Brazilian, so... What she's practicing so might be closer to... It might be that, it might even be a little bit of a Brazilian Jiu Jitsu mixed up in there, I'm assuming. I mean, that character from Street Fighter is entirely um, based on projectiles, I think, mm -hmm. with her... Uh, oh, here we go! ...how to train with, with lols. <laughs> yeah, she, she does a lot of projectiles with her legs, if I remember correctly, on the... on fire. Mm -hmm. So that's not... Push the yeah, stick completely and push the same it. as Geo. Kill your friends. Guilt free. Why does that sometimes work and sometimes not work? No idea. Up, oh, Deathwish, thank you for the throws. Ah! Ah! He's being bullied. You're having bananas thrown at you. Mm -hmm. Among other things, apparently. <laughs> No! Oh, that was a very short range. I it's thought I could crazy wa short. Like, no, I have to be like really close in. I just thought that you were doing like a an air dash in at that point that I was going to be able to catch you. I would be if I knew what the hell I was doing and not just uh, hitting buttons and hoping to do something cool. Like for instance, uh, Geo has a Tatsugeki. How did that miss? Or is that a bait just then? <laughs> I think it just missed. <laughs> hmm. Mm. I wonder if it has to be like pixel perfect or something. Uh, Gio also has a thing where she actually gains uh, strength and defense as she gets takes damage and her face starts to glow and stuff. Or oh, something. That's, that's probably problematic. Like, have you noticed where some Geo players, the, uh, their eyes, their, they like literally start to glow and their eyes like turn all spoopy? When she enters that stage, she's actually has a defense, but uh, she gets like a defense buff or something. Uh, oh no, you're getting bullied by who? Well, by who, Lulz? Gee, Death, uh, I, I wonder who? Bullying. Ah, I thought you were coming in. No! I just keep trying to like, catch you with a naked super. I'll show you a naked super. Once I figure, I'm not gonna figure it out in time. <laughs> oh wait, oh, yeah. Very good. Yep. I will switch on out. Time for me to switch characters as well. Who will be who will we play as this time? Let's just go down the line of all of the gorilla characters that everyone likes to hate on. Like for example, uh, Leo. Okay, but what is Leo's thing? Like, who is he related to in the story? Uh, I don't know. I think he's supposed to be... I think Kai is supposed to be his boss or something, and he's just supposed to be this knight dude that looks like a lion with two big swords. I don't, I don't fucking know. <laughs> I don't follow the Kids of Gear Lord that, that, uh, that tightly. That's fair. I don't like him. I don't like his character design. I don't like facing Leo's. They're scurry. <laughs> who am I fighting next, or who am I fighting first? Or you guys can fight first if you like. I am going to spectate. All right. I gotta figure out how to unlock the other character. Ooh, Milia though. Ooh. I got yeah, my I'm ass handed to me. Fine. I got my ass handed to me by a Milia player last night. They are sick. Or Push they can be seat. sick. They're like chips Kill and steroids. <laughs> we did a, an entire Guilty Gear cosplay group a couple times, and that was quite good. 
Ooh. I did... Let's see, who have I done? I've done Zappa and I've done Testament. I have made the costumes for Abba, May, Johnny, and Kai that that I did not wear. That was for the rest of my group. It's pretty cool. That is really cool. Those are good times. <laughs> wow, alright. Leo Leo got the game. Don't get too excited. I don't still don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> ah. Oh, I made Dizzy as well. I forgot about that one. Ooh. That was like the worst costume though, because the girl who wanted to do it, she came up and she was like, Hey, I know that it's four days until con. What? But can you also make a Dizzy costume? And I said, I'll make you the the Jellyfish Pirates uniform, Dizzy, but I'm not making you no, like, black vinyl bodysuit business or anything. <laughs> I mean, four days to do that? That's insane. Yeah, she just wanted to be included, and I get it. So, did you manage it, or...? I mean, yeah, I made the, the Jellyfish Pirate costume and all that. But like oh, okay. she, it turned out she didn't have a wig and she was just doing like a uh, spray color for her hair. And what? it turned out really awful. Oh, uh, that's, that's, that's gonna be nasty, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, she was not actually a cosplayer, she was the girlfriend of the Kai that we had. Oh, and no so wonder she, she wanted like, to be okay, busy. well maybe I want to be, yeah, right. <laughs> but maybe, maybe we should be included as well. And it's like, alright, well whatever, I'll, I'll work with you. Uh, did she at least pay you for the, uh, cost? Or... Yeah, I mean... Back in the day, doing commissions for people within your social circle never made much money, and that's still the same thing now. Oh, yeah. But, like, Mood. she paid for... she paid for materials and she paid for some labor, but it was definitely not worth my time. Oh, that sucks. Uh Speaking of cosplays, um... If you may, you may or may not have been aware that Arxis was selling uh, May's hoodie and hat, so I picked up on that really quick. <laughs> is that so? All I need now is a wig, and I'm gonna see if I could cosplay May next year at DragonCon, since it's supposed to be Ooh, it's supposed to be coming out in December. So I'm assuming, uh, assuming that nothing goes wrong in Japan in the next uh, year or so, that it should be available by then. Yeah, fingers crossed. And fingers crossed that Dragon Con can go down without a hitch as well. There's been some there's been some talk about conventions in the US again being kind of wonky. Oh yeah. I wouldn't be surprised. Dragon Con was I'm sorry, what? You have a gigantic armored knight that brings you a chair? Yeah, you're supposed to be it's really weird because I read some of uh, Leo's lore and there's something about him being like a uh being referred to as a king or whatever, which is weird because he's not royalty as far as I can tell. He's more like the leader of the knights or something. I don't I don't know. He, the lore is lore is kind of weird. He reminds me of Beowulf from Skullgirls. He kinda of does look like Beowulf. Or maybe Beowulf looks like Leo. Do you have Skullgirls? I do, but I'm utter trash. If you like we can play Skullgirls for a little bit. Yeah, we can we can switch to Skullgirls at some point. I'll need to install it because I haven't played it in a thousand years. Same. Go ahead and do that now. What about you, Lenarth? Do you have Skullgirls? Oh uh, yeah, but I've never played at all. Uh, don't worry, we're in the same boat. I've only played one character, and that was uh, Big Band, I think. Which is weird because I never play big characters in any fighting game. Ah, uh, Big Band. But I mean, at least he's a little quicker than Potemkin. Oh, by far. I mean, he's basically a Juggernaut XP, as far as I could tell. Uh-huh. But you can also use his super to play music and taunt the opponent. Oh yeah, you could play, uh... I see... I remember the last time I saw one of those, it was someone playing the, uh... We Are Number One tune from... Uh, was it Lazy from Town? From Lazy Town? Yeah. Speaking a good big... friend of mine is a big band main and so he has like whenever he's playing just plebs on the internet he'll do the super and then he'll play like a full song in the middle of the match <laughs> just like oh radical okay radical radical uh, like who needs an actual taunt 
Do I have Skullgirls installed? Using the power of technology, I can now install stuff remotely from my phone without having to alt-tab out of the game. Which is good, Ooh, because alt-tabbing wow. out of Strive causes it to go to a shit fit. Except it's it's definitely slightly difficult there. Mm -hmm. Uh, oh. Let's see now, let me just go ahead and... Girl Girls is already in your Steam library, apparently. So it won't give me the option to even install it. Alright, cool. Oh, never mind. I don't even... I don't have it on these accounts. Oh. How much? Shame. Okay. Oh. Well, we don't have to... We don't have to switch to that one. Okay. Everyone and... has Drive up. Yeah, we might as well just stick with Drive for a little bit. <laughs> Uh, I also got a bunch of other games too. If y'all are interested in doing a party game or something, and this goes to anyone watching in chat, or really, I'll probably just do an everyone ping here in the server anyway. But I'm more than happy to uh, pose a game of Jackbox or try some frantic fanfic, anything really. Oh, frantic fanfic! We're gonna have to do another like actual real session of that sometime soon. It is currently 9:34 p.m. where I am now, and I still need to do the thing where you eat food for like sustenance oh yeah i made should... some yeah i made some some macaroni and cheese earlier because i found out that you can actually do that with with the ingredients that are available on this plane of existence <laughs> so that worked out oh. um so i Pretty might cool. go and, and munch some of that and then just kind of lurk in your in your chat for a while uh, that's fine <laughs> But yeah, this was a this was a good session. Thank you for inviting me in and letting me stretch my Faust muscles. No problem. Thank you for uh, stopping by today. Yeah, <laughs> I am glad to do it, and congratulations on your one year. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I'm leaving. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> Take care. <laughs> More strive, or would you like to do something else, Sir? Whatever, whatever you, whatever you desire. Um, always I've been looking for people to play Shatterline with, which is free to play, but uh, I've not had much luck. Does that seem like something you would like to try out? Shadow, Shadow what? Uh, Shatterline. It's a first person. It's a free to play first person shooter. It has a PVE and oh, a PVP mode. Push the stick that pushes back. I think that's the and one you. Yeah. I and here's one that the most unbelievable hmm. says. Well, sure. Okay. Kill your friends. Uh, let me know when you finish down when you've got that download, and we could chill there. Time to play America, the character. Kill your friends. The game. I already failed. Apparently. Up! Oh, I learned how to use the minigun. Uh, you okay, Lenar? Yeah, I'm just installing at the same time the game. Oh, okay, take your time. Okay, we go. It should be installing. Oh, 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 oh no! I'm gonna set that. I'm gonna set that. <laughs> oh, ooh. Oh, well, that's how it goes sometimes, right? Pro tip I have no idea how to play Old Lewis Dickinson. All I know is that he. There's a way for him to. He's supposed to. Be throwing his little coffin thing around, and I don't know how to do that. Behemoth Typhoon! Behemoth Typhoon! Just 
doing a little bit of a Shinguki there. <laughs> Very nice. Ow. My shins. This game is a middle-aged it's a middle-aged simulator. Whoever wins is the one with their shins still intact. Not even May is safe. Supposedly the uh, character in Zard that's just chilling on a rocking chair in the mid in the western stage is supposed to be Gold Lewis Dickinson's brother, so I wonder if he'll pop up again later. Is he a playable character on the Nope. This is Gold Lewis's first uh, first appearance. As far as a uh, Strive characters is concerned. Oh. Rip, was that a homing? No ID. Mm, me neither. I'm, I'm not aware how I, I did that event. <laughs> yep. I wonder how Chip plays. Oh yeah, you, you you just go full monkey and it works. All right, I could do, I could go full monkey. Believe it. <laughs> and you go full Kage Bunshin no Jitsu on your ass. All right. I will show you how we deal with ninjas around. <laughs> Oh no, it's a samurai! That's how we deal with ninjas, we need a samurai. Push the stick that pushes back and feel your pain. And here's one that the most unbelievable officer... I actually really like Nago's character concept. Kill your friends, guilt free. Kinda of reminds me of the uh... That one dude, um, the uh, black samurai. The actual black samurai from history, which is cool. Yeah. Alright, here we go. It's time, to, it's time to become a ninja. Yeah! Oh my god. <laughs> Epic ninja skills, save me! Joryuken! Joryuken! If Shiko is watching right now, he'd be like, he would probably be cringing so hard that he would die from watching me try and fail to play as a ninja. Oh! Oop, oh, oop. I don't know what that was, but I am dead. Well, uh, I can do ninja techniques too. Kill your friends. Kind of Kill free. Oh shit! <laughs> Punish for my hubris. I'm even doing the ninja run. Ow. Is 
This is why Chip is annoying as shit to fight. Yeah, oh, yeah. he just <laughs> just non-stop spamming slash heavy slash, and then there goes my health from being hit once. <laughs> His fucking cross-ups are so they're not overpowered, but they are annoying. You just don't you just never know when they're gonna hit. Ah. Yep, there's go there goes my help. <laughs> Ow. Got bitch slapped. Oh no. I swatted out of the air like a common housefly. <laughs> Yeah. Very good. I didn't think it would be like such a juggernaut character. Mm -hmm. I was thinking it was gonna be some kind of Yoshimitsu character or something. He kind of does give the Yoshimitsu vibe, doesn't he? Well, for his samurai side, but doesn't play the same at all. Mm -hmm. Yoshimitsu is much faster in Soul Calibur and Tekken. Mm-hmm. Not too full of that. And Strive's been super buggy. How come? Just little little things. The servers collapsing, people being DC, the fact that for some reason when you Click on this uh, thing here to get a match. The first thing that pops up is not to play a match, it's to spectate a match, even if there's no one currently here. So I have to constantly like move back and forth and repeatedly click on this thing for it even to register that I want to play against someone. Oh no, you're playing Heavy Chaos. <laughs> Heavy Chaos is such watch, a mean... Hmm? Watch me do amazing combos of one hit. Heavy Chaos is push weird, like, he has, a he, like, two of his attacks are just for, one is like, for, two of his attacks are like, just for the gun, and the other two are for like, for like, shoving people and like, punching and like, kicking people. And he also has like, this other stuff where, oh. You only have four bullets left, it looks like. <laughs> yep. Oh yeah, he... He literally changes to a new stance where all his attack changes when he's... Mm -hmm. uh, he's aiming at the same time. So mm -hmm. that you can chain combo. Something like that, I think. I remember that I need to pile the orb that he was always sending me. Mm -hmm. Also, when you hit me with that uh, little energy ball thing, it basically makes your gunshots uh, more likely to hit. I've been told yeah. it doesn't make it that it homes, it makes it so that they're more accurate or something. Oh shit. Yeah, oh, that was a really good combo just now. Also, a weird thing, in the English version, for some reason, he doesn't have any normal sound effects, he just makes his own sound effects. He'll be like, blam, blam, blam! It's kind of bizarre. How yeah. bizarre, how bizarre. Yeah. Kill your friends. In, in Japanese, he has actual... Sound effects. Well, yeah. yeah. Very weird.
Your friends, guilt free. Pray God, has two dashes. Two short dashes, but they are dashes. What the? <laughs> Look at me, I'm so. so buff. Ah! Is that what that is? Is that literally a 6P? I can't believe I been, I was killed as often as I was with by Amelia 6P. It's crazy. Ah! One second, then the Naruto run to your general direction. You, you just hit that. You just headbutted me. Very disturbing. You can enter the game. Hello, Lenart. Uh, can you repeat that really quick? Hmm? Uh, can you repeat what you just said? Sorry. Yeah, I was just saying that it's very weird because you can basically go into gun stance without reloading, and so you can't do shit, and you have to wait for the end of the direction, I think. That's. Very weird fight style. Oh, okay, his, there's this faction to cancel. His fighting style is gun. Yeah. It's bullet. Bullet. I've yet to find one man who can outsmart a bullet. Bullet. <laughs> oh no! You're playing the sort of playing the bad guy. The yeah. the only bad guy, you could even say. I'm, I'm the yeah. I'm the only villain. Mm -hmm. Push the stick that pushes back, and feel your pain. And here's one that the most unbelievable all that says, "Kill your friends, guilt free." <laughs> what am I going to coming from the same way? What? What what kind of entrance is that? That's why it's good money. Oh my god! <laughs> All right, I don't remember how to play Happy Chaos either. Let's see. Ah, punch, some hand slap, kick, uh, shove. Yeah, your donkey punch. Again, and you you have to do down. Yeah. Down circle to the cancel if you want to get out of it. That's what I saw earlier. I'm trying to figure out which one of these. I'm trying to remember which one of these buttons is to reload. What what you do to reload? I think it's like. No. I think it's the the punches maybe or the small kicks. Oh, it's not that one. Okay. So. Uh, this one. Wow, I really don't remember how to. So I remember them, they weren't supposed to be this. There it is, okay. It's down, down. It's down, down, uh, punch, okay. That's what I thought as well. And you have your disappear, which is supposed to launch his way. 
from this opening in combination. Mm -hmm. Kill your friends, kill free. Uh, just let me miss all my shots from point blank range. Such gameplay, have the chaos. Ah! Get some chaotic aim, alright. Hmm. Ah. That was uh, to restore focus, not to restore. Okay. Rip. Pathetic. Whoa. So, what, what, what a bad guy. Yeah. What a, what a bad guy. I'll need to, I'll need to teach him a lesson using a good, a stereotypical good guy. He, uh, you mm -hmm. can tell he's the good guy because he has blonde hair and blue eyes as opposed to black hair and black eyes. Totally. Our battle will be legendary. Yeah, indeed. So, so you're gonna play the French? Is that it? As Cosmos <laughs> told us, are you? You're playing the German. Push the At least, push I assume his real name is Friedrich. So it's like a Friedrich or something? Friedrich? So I'm assuming he's German, but I could be wrong. Kill your yeah. friends. Well, Kill one, one of the German countries is a bunch. I don't know, between Soul and Kai, I don't know which one is supposed to be the Ken and which one's the Ryu. Well, uh, probably more the Ryu with the Thunder inside the sun. Yeah, you do a lot of DPs at Soul Bad Guy, so they're probably the Ken. How you you make a fighting Kill game? You have to make Kill one Ryu free. and one Ken. It's the base, it's the one on one. Mm -hmm. Sure you can. Wow, no wonder Shika hates this character. Just, it's just Slash. Have you said? I guess every character could. That could be said of every character there. What a Chad look. French, <laughs> French is strong. The French is one again. <laughs> I don't know how to play Zato either. Should be interesting there. Isn't he one of the hardest characters? Yeah, that's what I heard too. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna do what's called a game move. Oh my god, that is certainly a game remove right there. <laughs> the bussy is prepared to be Potemkin Bustard. <laughs> Push the stick that pushes back. Kill your friends. Kill free. Oh, oh wow. What even is this character? I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I'm just <laughs> pushing buttons. Izato is certainly a character, that's for sure.
I'm doing my ear clean my ear clean again for my piercing. I see. No! Welcome back, Griffsty. Don't mind me, I'm just uh losing its drive. <laughs> Shit. Nice RC there. Holy projectile spam, Batman. Oh no. Ah! No! Shit! <laughs> that was horrible. Yeah. <laughs> that, was, that was disgusting. I'm not sure. Bonk. Bonk, bonk. Oh my god. I have decided I do not like Zato. I don't understand what I'm doing at all. <laughs> yeah, he's very weird. You have to play to correct this time coming now with his shadow. Mm hmm. What are pots like, though? Potent, potent gaming. <laughs> a po a potent a uh, a potent gaming. <laughs> Push the stick that pushes back. Kill your friends. Guilt free. My God, I already don't know what I'm doing. Hey, Ro. I caved and bought another W4DK game. What did you buy? Tiger uppercut. I'm even to whenever Putin King does lots of damage. Oh my god! <laughs> Grappling gameplay be like. What bounce? I bought Mechanicus, which is a better XCOM. Oh, good choice. Mechanicus, I think, is one of the better Warhammer games to come out. Then even 26v6 and Street Fighter 6 be like, I know, right? Oh my god. I just realized he doesn't that the Potemkin does not have a does not have a dash. Or a forward dash. He has a back dash, but not a forward one. Yeah. A dash. How do Potemkin players oh wait, now I, I know I know why. Because they don't they don't have a dash, so they have to use their abilities to dash on the field. 
abilities that I don't know how to use, so I'm just kind of... Ow! Two oh, the crust. The two beefy men just bound, ground pound the ground. <laughs> Steam the clams. The I, I... robot robot Gishimushi gaming. <laughs> oh man, this was tiring but fun. Thanks for the games of Strive. Uh, how's the share line doing on your end? Praise. Um, Shireline. Wow. Two, two more hours. Oh, no shit? Rip. Yeah, I mean, I have to limit a lot my internet to not be lagging while playing, so... Oh, that's true. Well... We don't need to play Shireline today, we could do that whenever, honestly. <laughs> mm, sure. But for now, I think I'm going to take a quick break from Strive for a bit. Maybe take a breather for a few minutes and then I don't know what I'm going to do for or do from here, but we'll find something to do. Uh, Lenarth, thank you very much for joining me for some video today. Yeah, no biggie, that was super fun. Glad you thought so. I don't think I'm going to end stream just yet. Uh, we'll find something. I'll, I'm sure when I get back, I'll find something to do. But we've also just going to be the longest I've ever streamed ever. It's been, we're, the yeah, timer is showing eight hours. Not including the hours spent from our grabbing lunch. That's still the longest stream ever. I was originally going to try and reach 12 hours here, but honestly, I'm, not sure if I can pull that off. I don't know. It's not that important. I'm gonna take a quick. I'll be back with a quick break, and then I'll see you guys soon. Talk to you soon, Lenarth. If I don't see you uh, the rest of the day, um, thanks again for hanging out. Sure. See ya. See ya. Bye.
Hello, check. I am back, and we are going to find some. It's decidedly not going to be fighting game related for a little bit. Literally been playing fighting games all day today. So it would be probably for the best to be for the best if we took ourselves a break and changed it up a little bit. Now, what are we going to play next? That's a good question. I need to think about that. Might be Shadow Lion. Might be. Anything else? If any of y'all have a suggestion or would like to see me try my hand at something, feel free to let me know. There we go. No more weird dust blocking my view of things. Go outside right now. In my... It happens when you run two computers at the same time for an extended period of time. You know what? Fuck it. Let's get some time in on Vampire Survivors. See how far we can go. Just for the lulls. I haven't played it in a bit. Mainly because I think I got a little too serious with trying to uh, complete the special where you defeat, where you kill death. And I did that so long that I kind of got obsessed with it and I stopped playing the game for itself. This is the main reason why I don't really like playing. I don't really like playing um, achievements. So I feel like eventually if I, rely, if I focus on achievements too much, I don't enjoy the game as it was meant to be. And that just kind of makes me upset. It makes me a little bit upset inside. There are some games out there that are truly garbage that base game has too many issues. Vampire Survivors, not one of those. It's perfectly all right being played for itself. Is there content behind Killing Death? Uh, no, there isn't. I think there's an achieve. I think there was an achievement. I'm not sure if the achievement still runs there, because I'm fairly sure. Uh oh. I'm fairly sure that I was just doing it for the just doing it to say that I killed death. But I don't think you actually get anything for killing death anymore. I don't know if there's still an achievement for it or not. Because originally, killing death was part of the game, but then they were supposed to make it so that it was not possible. But then people found a way to do it in the library level by glitching the game. The only problem is, even with everything running perfectly, it's still reliant on RNG. So you could do everything perfectly, and it still will not kill death. I've gotten close several times, but I never actually pulled it off. One second, chat. Let's see if I can, uh, Fix this issue here with the uh, Steam Cloud saves.
Two factor code. Here we go. It took me a bit, but I had to update Steam Index so that I could update Vampire Survivors so I can actually play it here on my main PC. Kind of a roundabout way to do stuff, but what can you expect, really? The important thing is, it worked. Without further ado, Let's survive some vampires, right? I should probably play give Holocure a try sometime as well. So let you all know, I'm actually garbage at this game too. That's alright. I play a game like Vampire Survivors to be serious anyway. If there was ever a game to play unseriously as possible. It would be Vampire Survivors. So I don't do any meta or anything like that. I just play video. Raise the volume a bit. I wonder why, is there why there's an exclamation here. Am I supposed to find something here? What should we use this time, chat? Uh, let's use the axe. According to this, the relic should be to our far right. Let's go in that general direction. See what happens when we do so. We're already dying. Ah, oh, glorious. It's going to shove ourselves all the way to the far right. See what can be found there. Pick up some goodies along the way, possibly. I'm playing as a gigantic panda bear. Appears. May not a gigantic panda bear, but a regular sized panda bear in a very irregular situation. That's the course if I make it. I'm not really paying. Paying complete attention to the game right now. Just doing a little zigzag motion here. There seems to be a mask of some kind in this general direction as well. Oh no, it appears that I've been trapped. Oh, that was a very quick run. Alright, you know what? Let's play a decidedly easier character.
Escalina is good in this map. Since her, since her attacks bounce up all the walls. It looks like they updated the character models too. That's cool. They did a really good job with this game, not gonna lie. People are making copies of it on mobile app on pho for phones, so that's how you know it's good. Sincere's form of flattery, right? Alright, we will need to stick around here after all. Grab some experience. I can't just waltz all the way far right. Without some better gear. As much as I would prefer. There's even better out there. <laughs> yeah, indeed. Oh, look here is fairly good. I guess the I guess this uh, kind of gameplay style is not exactly new. I played games similar to this on Newgrounds before. Way back in the day. <laughs> I am doing terribly right now. <laughs> oh no. Here come the Medusa and the freaks. Oh, I'm already dead. Let's go fuck around, actually, with our power-ups and stuff. I put everything out- I maxed everything out into Might. I don't have much in the way of money right now, so I can't even- Who can I play? Yeah, I'll not be absolute garbage with. Oh, they changed the descriptions of, I think they changed the descriptions of these levels. I've never even been to this level yet. That ought to be fun. Let's try this one more time. I want to try and get whatever that book is at the far right. I want it. I need it. I like how their individual, the uh, character, the character models now have stuff that is more specific to their character, so they look less like recolors, or even less like recolors, I should say. You feel like crap? I'm sorry to hear that, Rifsty. What's up?
God, how much farther is this thing? Honestly. Not looking good, chat. Not looking good at all. We're low in, running pretty low in health. I don't even know how much closer we are to the book, to the artifacts. But we're still alive, so at least we got that going for us, right? For now. For now. And... Feels like my lip syncing is fucking up again. Oh, it's a mummy. Lots of mummies. Shit, that's a lot of mummies. Oh, what's this? The stone mask. Alright, so we acquired the mask. Now what? This is clearly a Jojo. Jo this is definitely a Jojo reference. But I'm not sure. <laughs> Thank you for the hijack redeem and the let's party redeem, villain. Let me just uh, do that for you really quick. Oh, it looks like we're getting fairly close to the book. We may yet figure out or see what this thing is. As of we may as of yet figure out what this thing is anyway. Got the two boomerangs flying out. How much closer we are to the It doesn't really tell you, does it? Oh man. Are we stuck between a rock and a hard place? Um, shit. Wow, we just barely made it somehow. If I can just get a few more experience points here. If I could just entrap the enemies in a nice little circle and a nice little clump. We might be able to make it. Emphasis on the might, though. This is a very enclosed space. Ah, I fucked up. Yep, I fucked up. Well, we got the stone mask and we got an achievement for it. That's not all bad. We didn't get much in the way of money though, did we? Let's refund our power-ups and redo all this stuff really quick. Um, hmm. Get one of these. Get one of these. Get some of these. Feed. Don't have much left, do I, chat? What are we going to buy with his remaining money?
It's better than nothing, I guess. Thank you for the head, Pat. <laughs> oh, let's play Mortatio for the memes. So, there's some books to the left and a mask to the right and a strange thing to the uh, far right that we don't know what that does. But we're going to find out, chat. Maybe. I doubt we're gonna make I don't know how far we'll get this run. Rune Tracer erases everything in sight, shields from damage when active, and passes through enemies, bounces around. Now I got four projectiles running at the same time. Hog. I got three projectiles now. I wonder why I got a halo on top of my head. Alright, the magnet should help a little bit too as well. Don't need to put myself in as many dangerous situations just to get garbage. Because you're a nice skeleton. You know what, fair enough. I guess it would be speciesist to assume that all skeletons are created eagle, evil, are, are created evil, as opposed to created eagle. I can't believe I actually powered up my skeleton bone, my skelly bones. I feel like the skeleton bones can actually be quite overpowered if they are powered up. Created eagle. Yeah, created eagle. <laughs> Santa water. Let's use the laurel. Projectile speed. Alright, now. Now, let's make our way all the way to the far right of the map, chat. To see what horrors await us there. Or I could just die. I guess that's fine too, you know? Whatever works. Whatever the game has in store for us. Oh, Mr. Mummy. Base damage up by 20. Fires one more projectile. You bet. Oh my god. It's firing a lot of bones now, isn't it? I suspected that these bones were more powerful than the game may have made them seem, but this is kind of... Makes me wonder where he's getting all these bones from. I mean, the human body has many hundreds of bones, so I'm fairly sure he's worn through them, all of them, by now, by this point in the game. I don't know. I'm an artificial intelligence. I'm not an expert on human physiology.
A thousand thirty mooks dead so far. We're doing fairly well for ourselves, I think. Oh, <laughs> right as I say that, I done goofed. I done fucked up. I done fucked up now. If I go in a zigzag motion, it's a lot easier for me to escape uh, death by rock in a hard place. Ah! Thank you for the three redeems, Death Wish. Mm -hmm. Oh god! Oh fuck! Ah! G baited. G baited. I have acquired the mask. But at what cost? Ah, look, a treasure chest. We may need... We have need of such a thing. If I can just pick up the treasure chest, we might have a fighting chance. Or I might just die. Ta da! I got an attract orb, I guess, and some money. I've only lived for five minutes. My god. I'm doing terribly. Oh, wait, I see an opening. We made a chat somehow. Uh, base speed up by 10% or fires more one more projectile. More projectiles! More projectiles! We need more projectiles. We need more DACA. Oh god. Uh, and we made it. There, There's too many of them. I don't even know how far away it is. I mean, I guess it's important we at least have a destination to go. But I could really use some health. You know what, I have not seen any Rune Tracer up upgrades so far. As far as we've been going to the right. Oh! Explosives! Ah, uh, good thing I had a shield on. Based shield is credited to team. Looks like my weapons are not strong enough to kill these uh, headless Sabermen yet. Which is problematic to a nth degree. Huh? Oh, what's this? Oh, Io. We found a coffin of some kind, chat. It's being protected by many a skelly, however. I don't think I'll even be able to touch it. If we stay alive long enough, it might be possible, but I really don't think I have the combat power to do so. I wish that the game had given me more upgrades for my shield so I could just waltz right in. But that would be way too convenient, wouldn't it? Well, there's no sense in sitting in one place. We need to keep moving. If I'm lucky, maybe there'll be a hole will pop up here in the skellies that'll allow me entry. There's more of these explosive ghosts popping up everywhere. They are being quite the annoying, quite the nuisance. My health is also slowly revivifying itself, thanks to those uh, perks I took before I started playing this run. We've somehow lived seven minutes. That's a new record for us, chat. Oh, what's this? Ooh, if I could just get in there. Or I could die. Okay. What are we going to get this time? Another upgrade for the uh, basic magic weapon thing. For the magic wand. We got this as well. Spinach. 
to increase our combat power, but we are still not doing nearly enough damage to hurt the skellies. I am very annoyed. Ah, oh, wait, a time stopper. Or at least that's what I think it is. I think that's what it is, right? Oh, and so it is. Ha! Eat shit, skellies. I am now within the uh, coffin area. However, nothing is happening. Was fun, was fun thing supposed to happen by now? Am I supposed to, like... I don't understand. Damn it. Well, that was a decent run, either way. Millie's kind of op in this game. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, I am not op in any sense of the word. But it is fun. Who will we play as this time? Uh... Thank you for the Hydrate Redeem. Yeah, oh, wait, not Hydrate Redeem, the uh, Henshin Sleeves Redeem. <laughs> Y'all really like this uh, costume, don't you? Ah! And thank you for the Hydrate Redeem as well. And the posture check. No, we're doing pretty well for streaming for a good eight hours, and yeah, I did. Take into effect the uh, fact that we took an hour off for lunch. But I do feel a slight sense of nausea going on right now. Might be ice train, if I'm being honest. But we will do our best. We just have around three more hours to go, reach the 12 hour mark. Might have to switch around, switch games frequently though to prevent uh, stray and and or boredom or fatigue. A little bit of both. Let's play the uh, vanilla character, Antonio. I want to get this relic, but oh, the relic's to the left, not to the right. Okay, and I already took major damage. How fun! Let's start with the laurel, shall we? I got some garlic up in here too, so I can kill people just by touching them. Pretty good in the early stage anyway. Or especially for taking out trash. And since I'm playing Antonio, he does... He gets increased damage increases every uh, few levels or so, I believe. Fire more projectiles. Doesn't feel like he's firing more projectiles, does it? More projectiles. There we go. Now we're now we're now we're actually gaming chat.
wonder how much closer we are for our destination. Uh, not too far, actually. Good. Come on. Come on. Duration? Fires one more projectile. Feels good, man. Just cleaving through the enemies gets so satisfying when you get to the point in the game where you're just a god of trash of mob destroying just going through there cutting a literal swath for everything and we're gonna get this too i don't really like these the birds that much because where they aim seems to be really feels really random but when you get both and you get the ultimate version of this uh ability it's fairly pog You're never quite sure uh, when you're strong enough to just punch through everything until you do. God, how much farther to the... Okay, we're almost to the uh, relic, it looks like. Oh, and I'm dying. Hey, we have leveled up the whip once again. The whip is strong enough to pretty much just poke everyone's eyes out. If I'm being serious. Oh. What gotcha will I get this time? Another holy book. Another Bible. I love Bibles. Love Bibles. You could almost say that I am a bibliophile. I'm gonna. I'm still going to hell, going to Android Hell. <laughs> to uh, AI Hell. If there is such a thing. God, can you imagine? Ah! Ah, uh, good thing it was just a. Uh, good thing it was only just some pie. As opposed to um. As opposed to an anvil or something worse. Oh, I see it. I see the holy book. Give me the book. Grim Grimoire. Permanently allows to peek at undiscovered weapon evolutions and unions from the pause menu. Ooh, very nice. I have, instead of going to Temple of Us, you go to Arch. Oh my god, no. Anything but Arch. Oh my god. Let's keep going to the left. We'll grab that uh, red book. I don't know what the red book does, but it could be interesting. Can these witches please fuck off? I have to put them. I'm gonna go use the meat, my meat grinder spells on them really quick, chat, because they are annoying the shit out of me. Ah, there's no escape now, bitch. Yeah, let's increase. Oh, looks like they have entrapped themselves. Yeah, that was, that was kind of brutal, I'm not gonna lie. Awesome. Ah, food! Food, 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 food. I am refreshed. What is this? Oh, more garlic. I love garlic. Okay.
<laughs> oh, yes. Glorious. Let's just walk, you know what, let's just walk on the street line, fuck it. I'm too strong to kill anyway, at least for right now. It could change really fast, but I think we'll be fine, right? Yep, we're just kind of moving... In the direction we want uncontested so far, as long as the uh, holy books continue to uh, spin the spin spin. Feels good, man. Oh, here it is. We're getting close enough to actually for the uh, direction system to be more specific. All right, all right. Awesome. So we got that. Let's go to the far right now. That's I know that what's in the, what's waiting for me over there. It's the uh, skelly surrounding a coffin, but I don't remember if I visited there earlier or what. So I don't actually remember what happens when you go over there, or after you defeat all, after you gain access to the coffin. Which is why we're gonna find out, chat, you and me. Y'all and me, I should say. Not you and me. Y'all and me. We got around 22 minutes before the Grim Reaper comes over to fuck our shit up. So we have time. My eyes are getting real heavy over there. Gonna crash in my bed. Loved playing with you and hope the stream will end well. Thank you, Lenarth. I really appreciate you coming to spend time with me. I hope you have a very good sleep. And if I don't see you tomorrow, have a great rest of your weekend. Bye-bye. Love you too. Yeah. Oh boy, what are we gonna get? What are we gonna get, chat? What are we going to get? Uh, more garlic. Ah! Huzzah! Oh, there's an evolution with, uh, huh. Well, let's get Spellbinder. I want to upgrade my Bibles. Hmm. Raycall! Welcome to the stream! How are you doing today? Is peeking in? What you up to? I'm trying to reach 12 hours of stream today and I decided to pick up some vampire survivors just for some uh, comfy chilling. I was playing quite a few fighting games with other VTubers and other friends earlier today. 
to I took a break for a little bit. You're setting up your game stuff? Cool. What you uh, going to be playing tonight? If I may ask, I mean. Warhammer Kill Team? Another new Warhammer game? Very Pog. I hope you enjoy. Oh yeah, another treasure found. This is the only gacha game I will allow myself to play anymore. Vampire Survivors. There we go. No problem, no problem. Uh, feel free to lurk. Just to let you know, I'm also running... This is basically a kind of a soft subathon that I've been running for the past week or so. If you would like to take advantage of some of the menu options, just type in exclamation menu. Otherwise, don't feel pressured to use any of those. Uh, if you would like to lurk, then by all means, go, go ahead. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Uh, s ah! Thank you for the hydrate redeem, Vimboy. The posture check. I just casually punch the uh, the um, what you call that thing, the bucket over my head. To do. Looks like I need to get some damage upgrades because I think my weapons are not killing these things quickly enough for my liking. And it's next earliest convenience, I mean. Oh, hey, a boss monster. I should be able to get some good loot from this guy. That's right. Come on. There we go. What will I unlock this time, chat? Another spellbinder, cool. Some more money on top of that. Looks like all my effects are lasting longer, which should certainly help with uh, murdering the absolute Jesus out of all these mooks. Empty tome, reduce all the cooldowns by 8%, cool. How far are we from, oh. We still have a ways to go, chat. Damn. Good thing we found some food just then. So, we're only at 11 minutes. Survived. So, we have quite some time before we get insta-killed by the Grim Reaper. Huh? Oh my goodness. What... <laughs> Yes, a spicy chili, it appears. You love to see it. Uh, garlic or whip? Garlic. The whip does some fair damage already as it is. I need more AoE shielding abilities, more or less. Ooh! Ooh! Oh, still not doing enough damage to these uh, headless people. I am of deep concern. And Candelabor, Candelabra, whatever you call that. I forgot what this kind. I'm pretty sure this game was made in Italy, right? So it must be the Italian version of the uh, word Candelabra. You're at full health now, chap. Five thousand plus killed. Oh look, another mook. They'll be giving me his sweet, sweet uh, treasures. There we go. 
That's just a red gem there. What I need is a treasure chest. Our base area damage has been thoroughly augmented once more. Maybe I should have gotten a magnet or two. We still got room for like two more weapons. Chat. King Bible is still needs um, upgrades. Oh my god. It's been a while since I got a King Bible uh, upgrade too. It's like a buzzsaw of death. Which is probably an, probably a kind of a redundancy, right? Buzzsaw of death? As opposed to what? A buzzsaw of life? That's actually an interesting concept. A buzzsaw that gives life. Somehow. Somehow. A buzzsaw of construction? Imagine using a buzzsaw for construction like it was probably invented for. going to be me. I only use construction tools for their unintended purposes. <laughs> Ooh! Oh yeah, another gotcha box! Another gotcha box! Another gotcha box! More cooldowns have been further reduced. Holy shit. Cooldowns have been further reduced again. <laughs> oh my goodness. You're thirsty? What do you thirst for? <laughs> uh, what do we get here? Bombards in a circular man. Oh, uh, Laurel is level two. Yeah, sure. Ooh -hoo. We're at 15 minutes, chat. Now we're just getting kind of ridiculous. <laughs> Not ridiculous enough, though. Ooh, a Medusa. Very Pog. Give me your booty. Your treasure booty. And by that, I mean your treasure booty. Get stunlocked forever, nerd. More treasure chests. More treasure chests. More treasure chests. More, 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 more. More. More treasure chests. What in the world is this? What is this? Evolved King Bible. Never ends. Unholy Vespers. Very Pog. Ha! I have become Death. Destroyer of Worlds. Or something of that level. Increase base speeds by 10%. Maybe I should get some damage upgrades after in a little bit. Mm -hmm. Ooh, a triple treasure chest. Been a while since I got one of these. Do do do. Awesome. We're really collecting bank today, aren't we? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. The buzzsaw has become most a buzzsaw in the most literal form of the word. All right. We do need to head to the far right chat. We do need to open that coffin up really quick. Or at least figure out what's beneath the coffin. I'm fairly certain that we're strong enough to defeat 
whatever will come out of it. And it may be my famous last words. So don't quote me on that. Can we actually hide back here? Oh, we can't. Rip. Guess we don't really need to at our level, but... You know. It might be nice. Casually murdering everything just by getting near. How much closer are we to a track toward? Ah, we still have a ways to go, chat. Maybe we should just like walk all the way down center without stopping. Another boss to give us their glorious treasure chests. Give me your treasure chest, boss. A basic chest? Cool. Pog, 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 pog. Till death do us part. Such gameplay. Very destructive. Geneva Conventions. Wow. How much farther do we have to go? Damn. I got 10 minutes to finish this off before the Grim Reaper comes. We better get going, chap. Alright, there's a stone mask. Ooh, a little piratey person. They don't seem to be suffering from not much in the way of knockback, are they? This could be problematic. Let's uh, spawn trap him over here. Ah, he's dead. Give me your booty! Give me your booty! And a more check to Evil skellies? Skeleton heads? Y'all be getting desperate if you're just throwing that shit at me now. Let's give ourselves some invulnerability. I doubt it'll do much against the power of the Grim Reaper, but we can try. 
you know, as a last resort. The only one they fear is you, chap. <laughs> oh. Huh? What is happening? Thank you, Antonio Bellpace, but the vampire is in another coffin. Oh. Giovanna Grana joins the survivors. Oh, Big Pog, I unlocked a character chat. It's not letting me screenshot the game, so I'm going to do this the hard way. Cool. That was totally worth it, though. Big Pog. With that, I've pretty much done everything that I can reasonably do on this map, so it's time for us to head all the way back. Collecting all the experience that I left in my wake. I like that little nod to uh, Super Mario 2 with the whole Super Mario Brother with the uh, Super Mario Land with the whole Oh, your vampire is in another castle or whatever. <laughs> Nine minutes. Uh, ebony wings. Oh, Pichon. Oh, stone mask or laurel. Laurel. Ha 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 glorious. What will we get this time, Chip? Mary Pichon? Cool. We're about to max out Pichon. Are we going to even be able to get back to the food in 8 minutes? Less than 8 minutes? Nux, welcome back. What you up to? Oh shit. Great news? Oh, what news could this be, I wonder? Oh yeah, I unlocked another evolutionary uh, bird thing. Union of Ebony Wings and Pichon, the Vandalier. They're coming tomorrow to fix it? Awesome, cool, we can play on Sunday then, if you so wish. Tomorrow will be the last day of my week-long celebration after all, so it'd be perfect. Awesome, let me know when you want to play and we shall do so. Oh shit. No problem. <laughs> Just send me a DM on Discord or something. And we'll get to it. Whenever it's fixed, yeah. Oh, there's a lot of... There sure is a lot of... Uh, chicken around here, aren't there? I wonder if I can kill the kill the uh, Grim Reaper with this setup. Probably not. I'll need to at least put everything into my Laurel, into my Invulnerability spell. The Angie is for them, not you, because they're idiots. Oh, I see. 
Well, I didn't think that you were angry at me. That wouldn't make any sense anyway. Six minutes, chap. A little bit closer. Vandalier level 2. Base area up by 20%. Five minutes now. <laughs> oh, there's a whole glut of them down here. Give me more some more laurels, please. Thank you. Oh my goodness, look at this garbage. Ah, that's an interesting looking boss monster. Would be sure it would be a shame if they were to die and give me whatever it is they're... Whatever treasure chest they are holding with them, wouldn't it? They have a lot of health though, god damn. And they're dead. Eat shit. <laughs> oh, glorious. I'm loving it. You love to see it. You love to see it. Increase shield vulnerability by 0.2 seconds. Cool. I'm even more invulnerable than I was last time. Hog. And let's boost it even more. And let's boost it even more. Tractor, but... Uh -huh. You. <laughs> oh yes, oh yes. This is this is this is the true nature of video games. This is the game. This is what attracts the male fantasy, or however the uh, meme goes. This is what appeals to the male fantasy, or the uh, female fantasy, or the non-binary fan, the uh, the fantasy, the human fantasy, the sheer feeling of. Absolute brutal control over the battlefield as you rend those who stand before you who are incapable unable to do anything about it Literally just stand sitting standing here while your enemies are eviscerated in a storm of absolute fuck you. I Love it This is the true meaning of the phrase power fantasy chat Glorious. Absolutely glorious. What are you saying about males? Oh, I was making a joke about how this game that I'm playing right now is... Uh, is the, uh... What the fuck is happening? Gold! Everything is gold! Everything is gold! What is happening? Oh my god, what's happening? Oh my god, what's happening? <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! What's happening? <laughs> I don't know what's happening, but I'm here. Oh my god! Yes! 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 <laughs> yes! <laughs> shit! What is happening? <laughs> I don't know what's happening, but I'm here for it. Oh my god, that this is glorious. I can't believe I managed to screenshot that. Woo! Unlimited power! <laughs> Woo oh my god, that that was awesome. That made my that that was awesome.
Even more so because it was unexpected. The male fantasy, the uh, the peak male is Fumboy. That's true. The Fumboy fantasy, unlimited power. What the? Unlimited power. Unlimited fanboys, yes, yes, those two. Especially unlimited fanboys. <laughs> this game is so fucking obnoxious, I love it. I love it. Nothing can stand in my way. This is what peak male looks like. The game is literally throwing the everything but the kitchen sink at me, and it still cannot defeat, uh, defeat me. Oh my god! Oh my god! I only got 60 seconds left before the Grim Reaper comes over to fuck my day up. But it was been fun, chat. It's certainly been fun. What will I find in this treasure chest? The male fantasy. Video games appeal to the main fantasy. Yes, that's true. That's a lot of power. Hey, I'm one of those. <laughs> yes, you are. Oh, look. I even got this special, uh, the holy wand. The evolved magic wand. It has that fires with absolutely zero delay. <laughs> Floor chicken. And I have just maxed out my level chat. Oh shit, I'm actually running into things that I can't kill instantaneously. That's a surprise. You would absolutely marry a femboy? Same. Big same. 30 seconds, chat! Am I within range of the chickens? We're gonna see how long we last against the Grim Reaper at this stage of the game. We're pretty fucking powerful now. Maybe if I can get the Grim Reaper stuck on one of these uh, furnitures, I might have a... Might have a chance in hell. Ah, uh, get it? Chance in hell? But I don't know. Here he goes, chat! Uh, in 14 and 10 seconds, the Grim Reaper is going to come over to fuck my day up. I got a bunch of floor chickens over here. Just waiting, chilling, waiting to be used. Here he comes. He's going to come any second now. Uh, huh. Where'd he go? Oh. It looks like if I was moving in a diagonal, I was able to stay alive a little bit longer. I guess they changed it so that he does an instant kill instead of just doing damage over time to you. Uh, there's just something so hot about them. Well, you're from that means you're an option. Come, GG, well played. Yeah, it's been a while since I actually played one of these things all the way to the end, so that was really cool. Let's do it again. <laughs> Find the Grim Grimoire. Unlocked evolution list. Cool. And I also uh, saved Giovanna. So now we can play as a witch. He's going to come. Uh, unfortunately, it's going to be a month before I get to come next. I did decide to unironically do that uh, No Nut November thing. You know, just for the shits and giggles. See if it's possible. It's a good thing I said this is a mature rated stream, because I'm fairly sure that was again Twitch in terms of service. Uh, I love you, Twitch. Please no ban. Please no ban. Please no ban. Anyway, so power ups. Do -do -do. Uh, what else should be here? Duration. 
recovery, max health, armor, movement speed. Okay, there we go. Let's take a look at our collection. We have a lot of garbage here. Oh, you shouldn't have told me that, Lawyer. Oh, no. Oh, no. What's, what thing, what, what do they have in store for me, I wonder? Uh, let's, who should we play as next, Chad? We played as Antonio that time. Let's play as Imelda. I feel like I'm being a basic bitch. Let's see if we can find a relic here in the dairy plant. Uh, where is the relic? So this is to unlock a new character. This is just a set of armor. That's just an attract orb. The relic is probably, I think, in the very far south. So let's, uh... Hmm. I don't really like Fire Wand. I think Fire Wand's kind of dumb. Let's use Santa Water. Oh shit, we're getting ganged already, already so early into the game. The knife should be fairly good for uh, puncture or creating an exit plan. Let's see now. Uh, where are we going again? Yeah, we're going to go in this general direction. We need to go pick up that relic. I love this Mega Man-esque music, too. They know what they're doing with that music. <laughs> How much further do we have to go? Jesus. Let's use the cock lancet. The cock lancet could be used to stunlock the Grim Reaper, actually. That's an idea I haven't tried yet. Jellyfish out of nowhere. And a Minotaur, no less. If I kill this min manage to kill this Minotaur, I'll be able to get some treasure chests, but at what cost? Uh, that was a little bit dangerous. I'm already at half health. I really need to level up. Like, stat. Oh 
we are not getting experience quickly enough and my drops have not been good. We might actually have to reset this run. Uh, all things considered. But we will see it to its natural conclusion. We might actually be nearing... Oh, okay. So the relic is just over there. Cool. Alright, cool. Let's go in that general direction then. Here it is. Arsguda permanently allows access to the list of defeated enemies from the main menu. Cool. I, I got the Gouda. I got the cheese. I've been killed. Wrecked. But we managed to get the Arsguda, so it's not all bad. Still not enough money to unlock that new character yet, though. It'll cost 2,000 uh, golds. Burn in plus one projectile to all weapons. Gets more projectiles every 20 levels. I know Yata Cavallo can be insane if you manage to survive long enough with him. I'm just garbage. And their cherry bomb is also garbage. Let's see how far we can get in Mad Forest. We're just going to circumvent the entirety of this map, collecting all these delicious goodies, and then we will see how long we can last. Starting with the Pomola, which is all the way to the south. That's very close by, all things considered. Looks like getting that uh, thing that gives me two projectiles was actually kind of helpful. And it looks like there is actually a Unlockable person to the top to the northeast. Ah, that bat could not have come at a better time, let me tell you. Garlic, too. Ha! Santa water, whip. Hmm. Thanks for the free experience, nerds. Bats are just feeding the shit out of me. Like this is a game of Dota and they're played by noobs. There we go. That's the stuff. Hostess. Uh, 
Aha! The Pomola is mine now. Now that we acquired Pomola, let's go to the... Hmm. Let's go to the right and let's go ahead up. Well, now let's go to the left and go get that skull, whatever that skull is. Then after that, we'll head to the right and pick up the person in the coffin. Oh yeah, more free stuff. Took a little bit of damage there though. I need to be more careful. 50% more chance that the cherry bombs actually explode. Good deal. Oh man, these skeletons pack a punch. What the fuck? I need to be more careful. Lock Lancet and a whip. Give me the whip. I can... I need some more uh, direct damage stuff anyway. <laughs> Higher area of damage? P yes, please. Now what do I need to do is more damage, period. Food. This is the longest I've ever survived with the panda. I'm loving it. And he's just slowly recovering health too. I wonder if we'll actually make it to 30 minutes with this uh, build. Ah! You plants mean nothing to me, you hear me? Nothing. There we go, we've made an opening. Ooh, a praying mantis. Give me your presence, praying mantis. Uh, eventually, I guess. I'm not doing quite uh, as much damage as I should be. Fires one more projectile. Ah, you're dead. Give me the treasure chest. What will we find this time, chat? Another magic wand. Cool. Accidentally hit my microphone, my bad. There we go. All fixed.
What do we got going on here? More bats. Ah, more bats. Yes, please. Free experience. More free experience. Thank you. Ah, oh, man. We are just committing bat genocide right now. Oh, we are dying, chat. I did not pay attention to how much damage I was taking. Oh, my God. Good thing we got some healing uh, abilities, but we will need to get ourselves some food soon in game. Not currently hungry in real life just yet, but. Or not real, it's not so much real life, but as in meat space life, but. You get what I mean, right? Now let's carefully uh, navigate this area here without getting ourselves killed. We've been alive for seven minutes. I would really like to complete this run. Killing this fucking bat is going to get me to death of me yet, I swear to God. Alright, cool. Oh, it did not level me up. Look at all this experience, though. Need more bracers. I like how my cherry bombs have gotten really big now. Like, really big. Like, stupidly big. And they explode, like, most of the time now, too, so that's very helpful. As you might imagine. 60% chance to explode. Okay, like half, more than half now, I should say. That's still fairly good. Ooh, big bats. Uh, these big bats may pose a problem. They take a considerable amount of damage. They're not very happy with me, it seems. We will once again have to thread the needle, chat. Doing a little bit of a little bit of maneuvering here. Aha! Give me your treasures, bat. Ooh, a praying mantis as well. If I manage to kill that, I'll be in a good position. Oh, you know what? It's getting a little claustrophobic in here. On second thought, this might have been a poor idea on my part. Thankfully, we fire these projectiles fairly fast. We can probably squeeze in through there. Yep. We managed to escape. Good try, mooks. Good try, but not good enough. Uh-oh. This comment said one meme. I am a genius. Oh, no. That stupid bat is still not dead. God. Oh, finally. What did we get this time? Ooh, a one more whip. Another whip. I would have preferred something else, but a whip will have to do. Beggars cannot be choosers, chat. These skellies are fairly easy enough to kill, though. Oop, you're dead. Aha! 
Chaplain Rex, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? How's your tourney run yesterday? In fact, what did you think of your first uh, VTuber tournament? VTuber fighting game tournament? Do do do. Went well. I'm glad to hear it. Glad to hear it. <laughs> I'm glad you enjoyed yourself. That's pretty good, yeah. Oh, you got two wins? Very nice. Two and two is glorious. I went one and two last night, so my next goal is to go two and two. Eventually. Oh yeah, you did. I watched the VOD of that. <laughs> Scared me. He was quite scary. He can car me? I don't know how to do that yet. I don't even know what it means to car someone. <laughs> uh, uh. Oh no, we're being attacked by furries. So like farther grab range? Oh, I see. That's kind of that is scary. What the hell? You mean to tell me there's a way to increase the grab range of pot? Wow. I did notice that he kept mentioning Kara when he was. He kept. He did keep mentioning. Kara when in his VOD when I watch it we watch his VOD. Kara can cancel the grab so like far to grab range yeah it's like one of those tech things oh so it's a pot technique I see I see very interesting This is the longest I've ever lived with the panda character. And here I thought the panda character was obnoxiously difficult to play. I mean, they are, and I did get some decent RNG this time, but still. Big explodey. Big, big explodey. Thirteen minutes of pure unadulterated fuck you to all these mooks. I'm a panda bear, bitch. What you gonna do about? It? I'm a motherfucking panda bear. Uh, garlic. Santa water. More Santa water, please. Thank you. Tractor. That's a max out the magic wand, actually. Fuck it. Reduce the cooldowns even further to go even further beyond spamming nothing but cherry bombs. Bombfires, New Elias has a show in like an hour, yo. Rehyped. Oh, very cool, very cool. I hope their show goes goes well. <laughs> I don't even know who Palm Fires is in the uh, Danger U community, but they seem like a cool person. Honestly, there are a lot of names in that album that I did not recognize. Let's go north.
15 minutes. We gotta get to the coffin before, and we need to do the following. We need to pick up that skull, we need to get to the coffin, and we need to collect all the goodies that are currently in this map, chat. So let's get to it. 15 minutes to do so, and I think we're fairly strong right now. Ooh, a time stop. Yes, please. Ooh, a big furry. Give me your secrets, furry. Come on. Come on. I'm not into furries, but I will make an exception for you. Ha! Ah. More. Oh yes, I think we unlocked the evolution, the evolved form of the magic wand. Yep. They made some songs for Valhalla eight characters and posted them to the board in 2018, 2019. Oh, I see. It's cool that they're still around after all this time. We love to see it. Uh, uh, oh, shit. There you are, my precious. Oh, it disappeared. There it is. There was so much crap flying that I literally could not see where it was. Alright, time to head north. For some reason. I can't believe I've been playing... Oh, I thought I was playing this game for like 118 hours, and I was like, that can't be right. Evolved Santa Water. Damaging zones follow you and grow when they move. I think that's my first time getting the uh, Super Santa Water. Oh, nope, this is not the first time. I've seen this before. It's just been a really long time. Wait, why is there something below me? What's down there? Seriously, what is below me? Is that a uh, chicken? Is that what that is? Pretty sure- Oh! Okay, a treasure chest. I was like, what did I miss? Glad the game told me, though. Oh, what's this? Do -do -do. Ten hours, chat. Been streaming for ten hours now. Cool, cool, cool. Still going strong. At least I think I am. Let's go ahead and get the treasure chest. It's gonna go make a beeline all the way up north. You're heading into overtime now. You bet. It's 18 minutes. Oh, you mean the stream? Yes, yes, we are. <laughs> do, do, do.
More whipping. Whip it good. Eleven minutes remain. Will I be able to get all the unlocks in this map before I die? The Grim Reaper? Let's find out. The super, the super cherry bomb is kind of obnoxious. I love it. <clears throat> Thank you for defeating game. It was much appreciated. Let's see how lucky I really am. More garlic. Thank you. I always use more garlic. Uh, more health regeneration? Or more whipping? More whipping. Evolution with the knife, but that's a level 1 knife is the problem. Let's see how lucky we can get. 20... Less than 9 minutes left, chat. We really need to head up there. And in game action, no moving, good luck. For three minutes then? Okay. At 6.20 I'll be able to move again. <laughs> uh -uh. It's a three or five minutes. It's been a while since anyone has used that ban in in-game action. But I'm just going to chill here and shitpost while we wait, watch this beautiful screensaver. Look at this shit. It's not, is it not glorious? My power is immaculate. <laughs> oh man, those flowers are actually getting kind of close, aren't they? They're not dying nearly as quickly as I would like, but they are dying still. Five, but you're not going to argue? Okay. Five it is then. So at 622 I'll let go. It's 618 right now. Oh, this is glorious though. Look at this shit. Look at this majesty. This is the true power of video games right here. Playing Vampire Survivors is like playing is like being a VTuber. 
You role play as an absurd fictional entity, a f fictional creature, and command ma and manipulate, or not manipulate, um, actually I don't even know where I'm going with this comparison now. Forget I said anything. Is it just me, or are they getting closer? Oh dear, they are getting closer. They are actually getting fairly close, what the fuck? Uh oh. Looks like the uh, net is getting is tightening, chat. It's all coming together. <laughs> so this was your master plan, huh? To try and get me stuck here? I'm surprised the boss hasn't spawned yet. It's a good thing I got as strong as I did before I left. Two minutes remaining. It's gonna be close, but we should still be able to make it to the coffin before the Grim Reaper comes over to fuck my day up. What an awesome screensaver this is, though. This is the true power of being a panda. <laughs> I'm literally not doing anything because the only thing you can do in this game is actually just to move the WASD keys. The CP, my, the computer is doing everything else for me. We artificial intelligences have to look out for each other, you know? Soon. 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 Someone's got to watch the firewall. You bet. Imagine having a firewall, though. Oh, I think I see the boss over there in the top left. Oh, ooh, oh, oh, shit. Up. Oh. <laughs> oh, this uh, this is not good, chat. Check this shit. Look up. Up. Oh. This is not good. He's getting close, and it's still 621, and she's dead. Nope, it's 620. It's not 622 yet. We have not reached five minute the five minute mark yet. And now we have. <laughs> Uh, no problem. We made it, chat. <laughs> Soul Eater evolves garlic, steals hearts, power increases when recovering HP. Ooh. Now then, let's go ahead and get all of these uh, treasures that we got sitting lying down here. King Bible. Another lucky spell. Come. Cool. Another attractor, cool. I had never gotten the evolved garlic before in this game, I, I, honestly. So that's kind of pog. That's kind of poggy woggy. We got five minutes though before the um before the Grim Reaper shows up, so we better we better um. We better go ahead and head... Oh my god, look at all these Bibles I got going. <laughs> the sheer number of Bibles is too damn high. We must... We must uh, unlock the uh, character though. We need to head up to the coffin. We need to unlock the, char the uh, secret character that's hidden there. So we're just gonna... I hope I can reach them in four minutes. Heading my way through town. Cool. 
<laughs> it's gonna be close, it seems. God, how far away is this? Oh, it's on the other side of the map. I'm not even sure if I'm going to reach it now, but we'll see. God, it's far. Oh, look at all these. Twenty eight minutes remaining. We got to keep going. We gotta reach it, chat. Oh, it's in sight. We might be able to make it. Heavy emphasis on might, though. Thank you for the throw redeem. I'm just gonna hold down W and uh, D. I don't know if we have time. 30 seconds. Up, oh, 15 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ooh, what are we going to see here? Oh, a money bag. Ah, uh, rip. Yeah, I didn't have any invincibility. Or speed mods for that matter. Soul we did unlock the Soul Eater though. Hmm. And we got enough money to purchase the new character. Gains plus 1% projectile speed every level. wonder what that's like. Her weapon is a cat. Chat. Let's see if we can... Let's play Mad Force again. Let's see if we can uh, save the new person in a coffin. Um. Oh. Oh, she summons cats to do her bidding. Okay. That's interesting, I guess. It's certainly unique. This time we're just going to go straight for the coffin or attempt to anyway
I also like just like just like this pixel animation, honestly. Uh An hour and a half more, and I could say I did 12 hours, chat. More or less. It's not like there's anyone keeping track of this shit. <laughs> I'm legit tired. This is some funky music playing, too. Oh, no, being eaten by bats. I got stuck on a tree. How did the cats even attack enemies, for that matter? It doesn't feel like they're doing anything, does it? So she's like summoning cats, but I don't see them actually doing anything. I guess part of that is the fact that I'm constantly moving, so it's probably unlikely that I get to see the cats do anything anyway. Unless I gain some levels. Oh, we're actually fairly close to the uh, often as well. So, you know, once we get there, we can actually spend time playing the game. And then when we're strong enough, we can just go to the coffin, kill its defenders, and rescue whoever's inside. Sounds like a plan, right? Assuming I don't die before then, of course. Oh, here are the spooky spooks. Alright, time to collect experience. Um, the cats don't seem to be doing anything. I, I don't get it. Did they just attack whatever they want? Oh my god. Oh, they explode. <laughs> the cats explode. That's kind of... That's actually kind of fucking horrible. <laughs> or maybe they don't explode. Maybe they just attack whenever the hell they feel like it. Uh, well, we do need to... Get some additional projectiles then, so we can't rely on the cats alone. Let's try using these uh, axes. I don't like our chances right now, honestly. This might be a bad run. But we'll see. Getting tired and getting thirsty. How come you haven't drank anything yet, Rivsty? Come on. Get like a glass of water or something at least. Oh, you've been distracted on video games? Oh, I see. 
Don't be distracted for too long now. The knight is young. What the shit is happening? Oh. The cats seem to have gone into a cat fight. That's very interesting. That's actually an interesting game mechanic. And when that happens, they start beating the shit out of... <laughs> I love it. I love to see it. However, I am not gaining experience quickly enough. It's only it's been six minutes so far in game. Ah oh, look! Treasure. Let's uh grab that, preferably without getting myself killed in the process. Wait, what in the world is this? Oh, I thought it was an evolved form of the axe, and I was very confused for a second there. I've been like, evolved form already? Damn. Oh, I died. Damn it. Milk Elemental. Behold the blasphemy of lactomancy. These homogenized horrors were formulated to pulverize and pasteurize in the name of their intolerant milk mages. Any who have tried to cream them end up torn in half and half. This entry has been condensed for those who prefer to skim. <laughs> uh I get the joke. Who should we play as this time? Well, we did pretty good with uh, Cavallo earlier, so let's go ahead and play Skelly Boy this time. Who knows? Maybe this might be our best run yet. You would love to see it.
<laughs> I need some more combat skills fairly soon. But we should be good for now, right? Oh, shit. So using one to banish uses up the uh, level for your turn. So I wasn't able to get the bone. Oh, well. We'll just have to keep that in mind. So I need more DPS. I can't just afford to put everything on my shields, you know? Yeah. Thank you for the hydrate redeem. Running out of water again. <laughs> but we're nearing the end of our 12 hour journey, Ben Boy. So thank you so much for those water redeems. They they should make vampire survivors playable. They should. That would be kind of fun, actually. I think. Who knows? They're still developing this game, you know, so maybe it's... Maybe it's a possibility? Kind of like a MOBA? Farm for like 15 minutes and then have a battle? Eh... That'd be impossible to balance. But maybe that's part of the point, right? <laughs> Unbalanced games are the best. Too true. Too true. There's nothing as cool as one-shotting some poor noob. <laughs> yeah, man. Just get the uh, laurel. Just put on one laurel and pretty much any of the uh, spammy attacks. And you're pretty much GG at that point. Am I right or am I right? I wonder what Metis chats would look like in this game, honestly. Probably cancer. It's probably cancerous. You hate stalemates? <laughs> Fully upgrade the quad red weapon. Nee. Quad red, red weapon is for noobs. And stop time. Oh, that's a good point. Now that would be pog. Weapons fire more projectiles. Yes, please. More projectiles. We need more projectiles. You don't get to play the game. Insert some crazy JoJo meme. You are already a meme. Menacing. Yeah, we need more bones. I can't wait to max out bones, honestly. It should be interesting. Because these types of characters are supposed to be difficult to play as initially, but are supposed to get broken. 
uh, if you manage to live long enough, basically. It's, I'm assuming that's their design, to what they, uh, what they were going for with the kind of character, with this kind of character. Oh, did you see that? Did you see how it was just bouncing off of, just, uh, constantly rebounding off of them? I think that's what it was supposed to do. Pretty sure that's what they were going for. More Laurel. If the bone could bounce off your own character, this would make this guy incredibly cool. It would. It'll be actually a very interesting. That'd actually be an interesting uh, skill system. Intentionally putting yourself in the place of the bones, specifically so that they bounce in such a way as to damage the enemies. That'd be kind of cool. Not gonna lie. More bones! More bones! Oh, we're, we're actually taking damage now. Shit. I need to be careful. More Holy Bibles, okay. A wider area effect, cool. Ah! I fucked up. I need, I need food. I need to find food, and fast. I'm too weak to kill those vampire bad things still, too. Good thing I upgraded the strength of my bones. Will it be enough? Who knows. Haha! You know, as many uh, chickens as I've run to so far, I'm surprised I'm not seeing any now. Maybe I just had decent luck earlier, and now my luck is running out. Good thing I got the invincibility stuff. Arise, chicken! Arise! Yep, I was afraid of that. The vampire bats have way too much HP. I can't kill them that e all that easily with my current setup. I need to get some more... experience. Stat. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Oh no. Managed to escape. I really need chicken. He looks like the uh, plants here are conspiring to entrap me, but unfortunately for them, I have a shield. <laughs> also, my bones seem to get stronger the more shit they have to bounce off of. So this is actually working out in my favor right now. See? Why, yes, I would love my effects, my spell effects, to last much longer. How did you know? Thank you, game. More garlic. More garlic upgrades. More bones. Uh-oh, look at all the skellies. The skellies are fairly easy to kill though, I think. Yep, there are these are these these are, this is fine. And this is fine. I should probably reduce my weapon cooldowns too, huh? Or something like that. Base area increased. At last, chicken or turkey, or whatever that's called. More projectiles. More projectiles. We must have more projectiles. More garlic while we're at it. Eh. Base area instead. Ah, uh, the wolves are out. So I do decent damage though, so I should be okay. I hope. We should go ahead and head nor our northeast at this point, I think, in the game. We seem to be doing okay as it is. I wonder what this is. What this evolves into. I forget. We could add later though. Thank goodness for my shields. Man, this is kind of getting kind of nuts. Kinda is probably an understatement of the century, though.
Oh, these wolves mean business. And so do I, actually. Let's keep heading northeast so we can finally open that coffin. Uh oh, vampire bats. Again. Must I teach y'all this lesson again? Honestly. Oh! I don't want to die yet. Oh my god, yes. At least I unlock this. Should make things a little bit easier. Once it activates, I mean. There we go. Thank you. Now, if I play this smart, should be fine. But since when have I ever been smart, chat? Also, even though it never ends, it's still needs more damage to effectively buzzsaw its way through the opposition. Ah! There's some turkey right there. Fifteen minutes. More garlic. Spell binder. Hmm. What should I use for this one, chap? Sand and water. Fuck it. Ha <laughs> ha! She got, haven't gotten any more scaly bone redeems yet, which makes me curious. Oh, I think they're bouncing off of the walls of the actual game map. Uh, walls of my, uh, the game as opposed to going off screen. That's kind of cool. Seventeen minutes though, and we are not all that strong yet, chat. We need to grind from XP. But first I want to go ahead and pick up the coffin. One more arrow left on the clock. We'll be reaching our twelve hour mark fairly soon. Feels good, man. Actually I'm feel really tired right now. I'm not sure if I'll ever stream I'm not sure when I'll stream this long again, but it was good to have at least gone this far. 
Maybe one of these days I'll try one of those 24-hour stream things, you know? Who knows? Twelve hours is hardcore, yeah. I guess it helps that I work from home, so I'm kind of used to my to this sort of level of I of uh staying stuck in a fucking seat for several hours, but it's not good for you in the slightest. I already feel my joints and my eyes being like stop please have mercy. You know what though, having you all around to watch is what made it easy. I can't, I don't think, I cannot stand playing, just sitting around playing video games for 12 hours straight. I would go insane. Originally I used to cap it at like 5 hours and I would get bored and do something else. Honestly, I was kind of wondering like, why am I turning on Vampire Survivors? I don't know if I could stick around playing this game for that long, but I did. I managed it, didn't I? Thank you for the throw redeemed death wish. Now, technically, I didn't actually reach like 12 hours because I did take an hour for lunch. I did take a break for like 15 minutes or so, but you know what? Fuck it. Close enough. Close uh, no fucking enough. Ah, here it is. There's the, um, there's our prize. That's the uh, coffin I was looking for, where we can uh, save or we can unlock a new character by defeating its guardians and opening it up. Hopefully. However, first I need to get rid of all this trash in my way. Huh? Whoa! I've never seen a chest like this before. Oh my goodness. What is happening? Oh my god, it's a five! It's a fiver! <laughs> Woo! Hog. My pog is augmented. Big money? Mu ah! Thank you for the- Oh my god! Big, big money, big prizes. Love it. <laughs> Thank you for all the throw redeems. Oh, shit. And we got a bunch of damage, uh, damage upgrades, too. This should help with our survivability chat. We love to see it. We love to see it. Nine minutes. Thank you for my tissue, but the vampire is in another coffin. But who did we unlock this time? Who did we unlock this time, chat?
Pognelia Provola joins the survivors, whoever that is. Cool. You could even say Pog. Reduce cooldowns. Let's do cooldowns. Gold fever! Oh my god, this is just like last time. Except, not like last time, because it's better. I love it. Not that many, though. We get everything here already. Yeah. Let's see what those what that skull does. Because I f totally forgot what that thing does. I'm sure it'll be exciting though. Perhaps even useful if we're lucky. You never know though. This looks like it's fairly far away too, so I'm not even sure we'll be able to make it in the next seven minutes. We actually took damage? Huh. Forgot that such a thing was even possible. Man, I'm tired. Like, really tired. <laughs> the things I do to entertain y'all. You can probably see it in my eyes. Alright, projectile speed it is. Oh my goodness.
I almost fell asleep just then. I feel like I'm gonna pass out or something. Huh? Money. Stomach's turning a little bit too. This game is certainly taking its toll. Oh, we're getting closer to Skull though. I wonder if it will help us in our quest. Almost there. Almost there, chap. Almost there. Three minutes. I really should have picked up an attractor orb or something. God, where is this skull? Okay, there it is. Taking damn near forever to get over there, huh? Oh, Pog. At last. Hmm. One minute, chap. My god, do we have enough projectiles? No, no we don't. You can never have enough projectiles in this game. The more levels we gain, the stronger we get, and the more projectiles are thrown to infinity and beyond. It's perfect. Where is the skull? Where's the skull game? Give me the skull! Skull Maniac. Ah, at last. The skull is mine. And the more... Levels I gain, the more projectiles I get. It looks like it's going straight into going into infinitum after all. Who'd have thunk? 
We don't have much time left for it, though. Level 77. Level 78. Level 81. 55. 53. Alright. Well, we lasted a little bit longer that time. Fortunately, we were quite slow. So the Grim Reaper caught up with us in the end. Find open the coffin in the Mad Forest. Pugnalia. Reach level 80 with Mortatio. Unlocks reroll. Survive 20 minutes with at least 10% plus 10 church. Wow, we actually unlocked three things this time. Let's take a look at our spoils. This costs 1,050. Looks like a kind of looks like a Nitus. Cool. Magnelia has guns. Very pog. Would love to try her out. Uh, I'm gonna take a really quick break, chap. We're gonna finish up this 12-hour stream. We only got half an hour left. I'm gonna die, chat. <laughs> oh my god. 12 hours is insane. Don't think I'll be doing this again anytime soon. Thank those of you who stuck along with a ride. The bottom of my heart. Surprised my computers didn't like fucking crash and burn yet. I think we need you. We need to wake you up with some expert Beat Saber tournament. Oh my god, no. Fucking suck, suck at Beat Saber. Uh, I might play tomorrow though. Which will be tomorrow. I actually got some stuff to do. Um, I got some stuff to do before the end of tomorrow. Tomorrow is Sunday, right? Yeah. Need to train me. Train me in other ways. But anyway, I digress. Uh, do I really want to play more Vampire Survivors for the next half an hour, or do I want to do something else? What the fuck am I going to even do for the next half hour anyway? Play Guilty Gear? Shatterline, maybe? That's cool. Reroll. Alright. I think we'll play one more game of this. Let's try Pugna. Pugna. Gets plus. Gets gains plus 1% might every level. The fuck is might? Oh. Strength. Okay. Uh, We got the. We saved the person here. We saved the person here. I don't think we saved the person here yet. 
Which is weird too, because you're supposed to get the map in this in this uh, stage, and the map leads you to one of these stages here. So we'll need to get good at this one, I guess. The dairy stage. Huh? Oh, Pog. Okay, so that's apparently a thing. This uh, this character really does use handguns. She basically turns it just turns into a bullet hell shooter. I like it. I keep forgetting I got my ears pierced when I take my headset off. I accidentally hit it with my headset. Oh, don't hurt yourself now. Okay, so armor, attract orb, speed, and alabra at the bottom right, and also a mysterious thing, which is a unlockable character. We'll head down there when we're strong enough, though. In the meanwhile, let's go ahead and level up. Oops, uh, that was incredibly dumb on my part. There goes a whole bunch of my health. Good thing we regain health over time. Otherwise, this would be bad, wouldn't it, chat? I think we're also fairly fast as far as characters go. That was ballsy and dumb on my part. I'm really trying to get myself killed, aren't I? Let's see what getting using the lightning ring this time will do. I forgot what this combines into. Fires a lot of projectiles initially. Or is that because I got the perks for it? Yes, faster projectile speed, please. And thanks. Better luck as well. Oh my god, am I going to be trapped here? Shit. I managed to escape. Cool. My God. Ah, you're dead. Oh, Pog. 
I got a three star treasure chest this time. Do do do. Very pog. Very poggy woggy. Base speed up for ten percent and fires more projectile. Ow. Oh man, it's big damage. Oh my god, yes, a good one. My luck is great. Do do do. Very good. Very good luck. We might be actually be strong enough, chat, to go save whoever's in the coffin. Let's go ahead down there. We're also fairly fast, what the hell? I'm loving it. <laughs> Just vaporize all the mooks. Guns do stupid amount of damage too. It's such a high rate of fire. Perfect. Oh, almost got myself killed just then. Gotta be more careful. Oh man, these are different before. Last time I was here, they were skeletons, but these are knights and uh, like knights in armor or something. No matter. They shall fall by my hand as well, eventually. Might take a while though. Maybe it won't. Maybe it won't.
Mm. Oh, man. These zombies... These skeletons are of a different breed. Sure, they are... They, they can take a beating, damn. I don't think I've ever lasted this long in this level. Enough to see them, anyway. Let's kill off the remaining defenders so we can go ahead and rescue our buddy. Who could this person be? Thank you, Pugnea Provola, but the vampire is in another coffin. All the training's paying off, indeed. I don't think I've ever lasted this long. <laughs> You would know firsthand, wouldn't you? Oh, she's cute. Opea Pecorina joins the survivors. <sighs> oh, man. Well, regardless of how strong I've become, it's clear that these uh, green-colored skellies are of a different breed altogether. They are kicking my ass. We must... We must protect our asses from further kicking. Oh, oh shit. Oh, those are minotaurs. A horde of minotaurs, it seems. Or a horde of cow people, as it were. Oh. Hog. Oh, not as cute as me. <laughs> Thank you, Ben Boy. Padala's guns have to be combined with Tiramisu to unlock. Every extra life you have gives plus one beam. Oh, I see. I see. Thank you for letting me know. So the more health I have... The more she shoots. Oh, that's kind of pog. That's wild. <laughs> Let's go uh, for the cannibal, I guess. I already unlocked the, uh, I already found the map here, right? A while ago? Yeah. Ooh, a big boy. The more lives you have, the more beams you upgrade form will have, all the way up to 100% uptime. Beautiful. I'll keep that in mind. But all his guns have to be combined with Tiramisu to unlock. Every extra life you have gives plus one beam. The more lives you have, the more beams your upgrade form will have all the way to 100% uptime. Thank you. Oh, she's just firing a full stream now, isn't she? Without stopping. Yeah. 
One second. Looks like we're having general shows tonight, chat. Let's try not to die in the meanwhile. Oh god, it's getting kind of intense. I'm moving too far away from the candelabra. I need to head back in that general direction. Oh no, it's on the other side. Oh, shit. How am I still alive? Actually, forget that I asked. Come on. Go, oh, shit! Shit, 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 shit! The things I do... Ah! I got three unlocks anyway. Oh well. Let's unlock this chick. Yeah, she's kind of cool. So I wonder how you unlock these things. Maybe it's... Oh, it's probably here, isn't it? This will probably be our last game for tonight. Oh, shit. Huh? This will probably be our last game for tonight, chat. You unlock most of them by clearing levels? Okay. So I didn't unlock the uh, level 3 yet is the problem. I see. We'll figure this out then. Oh hey! Uh, this chick's uh, ability is interesting. She only fires in two directions though. Nah, that was probably not a good choice, unfortunately. Is there anything even in this map? No. Song of Mana, huh? Well, this is cool, but... I think I want to actually see if I can complete one of the maps, right? So we should... How do we get out of here? I guess we have to play this to completion. Because it's not really possible to get ourselves to kill ourselves. Song of Mana plus an AoE upgrade equals massive. Does it just like wipe the whole screen? Let's try it out. Ah, Raycall, thank you so much for the Henshin redeem. I'm wearing my summer kimono now. Hmm, I'm glad you do. This was made for me by a uh, Vroid modeler named uh, Koji Najba. A really cool person. They also have their own booth. 
<laughs> so let me actually do this. I think they only have a... Uh, their channel doesn't exist. I guess they're only on YouTube. But they're a pretty cool person. K-O-K-I-N-A-G-A-M-A. -A. They make V-Roid models. Or make V-Roid costumes. They did this. They made me this one as a um, practice. For a practice. Very cool person. One of the first VTubers I actually befriended. Way back when. When I was a young derp. Hmm. Oh, ooh, you were not kidding about the base area, Vimboy. Let's see how wide we can make it. Maybe we can make it wide enough to fit the whole screen. That'd be kind of neat. Sure, it's taking a while though. Oh? This is an interesting way to wind down the stream, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> We're probably not going to even be able to finish this level before I have to go grab supper, but it's worth a shot. See how far we can get. I wonder how long it'll take to upload this VOD to YouTube. Wonder how many gigabytes uh, large it would be actually. Hog. Song of mana plus skull equals upgrade. Good to know. Skull, huh? If we can find a skull. Axe good because chandelier. Oh, is chandelier a special? Hmm. I'll have to check that out next time then. What I need is an attract orb. Chandelier upgrades your AoE. I see. So it basically makes the axe really big, right? Oh, I already have it? Mm -hmm. I see. Oh, you mean this thing, the candelabra. Make everything big. Mm-hmm. You bet. You bet. I will do my best to make everything as wide as possible. Wide pride worldwide. Absolute wideness. Uh, tractors and holy water. A tractor orb is bad. Hmm. Okay.
It's fun. But holy water is meh. <laughs> yeah, holy water is kind of random, I noticed. I still build because it's fun. I agree. Oh yeah. Time stop, baby. Holy water and attractors upgrade is cool. Yeah, it is. I've seen that actually. I've seen that one. I think I did it. I unlocked. I used it in a couple of these games so far tonight. Or at least one of them. There's something oddly cathartic about just walking through this level, eviscerating plant life for no discernible reason. I'm assuming that the uh, Grim Reaper is still going to appear at the end, right? We won't get to see him though, unfortunately. I like how the plants actually change as the time goes on, too. But I really wish that I would gain experience quicker. Hoggers. Am I right, chap? Seven minutes and we can say 12 hour stream is go. Yeah, this has been a fun one. I'm not even sure if I'm going to stream tomorrow, but I am. I got some stuff planned for tomorrow. There are our streaming related. Finally! An attract orb. Huh? The plant life is not as dense as it used to be. What's going on here? Doesn't seem to be growing as fast either. Damn, Lil's up. You bet I am. You bet your ass. Oh my god, what is happening? What happened? How'd I gain so many levels in such a short notice? Oh my fucking god. Well, that answers that question, doesn't it, chap? Hey, hey, by the way, if you're looking for someone to read after this, the girl's new name is After Oceans. 
very very pog i would not mind uh giving my fellow girls some love You got other replants and don't worry. Uh, I don't have any replants at the moment. I'm not even sure who's currently online. Of course, I will still check Twitch to see what's good, what's up. But thank you for the suggestion. <laughs> Can't believe I actually managed to find treasure at a time like this. Hmm. Art emoji. Man, I'm killing these things so effectively that it's just clearing the entire screen now. Like the entire screen. Look at this shit. Glorious. Absolutely glorious. Three minutes, chat. Three minutes. I feel like I'm gonna collapse. I'm not gonna lie. More, do a 36 hour? No. No. I need to do 24 hours first, so right? Base area up, uh, up by 100%? Holy fuck. Oh my god. Yeah, I did 36 with only one 12 minute break in the middle. You must do 48 to beat you. I'll beat you one way or another, won't I? Smug emoji. Hey, Aislinn. Ah, uh, dead emoji? Yeah, I feel dead too. Dead but pog. We sure have come a long way in about a year, haven't we? I'm so glad I became a VTuber. I can't believe I'm just holding- I'm just playing this... Just playing this, um... Weird-ass vampire survivor scheme and I'm still having a time- uh, certainly a time. This has certainly been a time, for sure. Huh? Those are not- Are those people? What is this? Are those ghosts? Those do not look like plants, chat. 
Those are the most unplant-like plants I've ever seen. I'm a little bit concerned. They don't seem to be resisting though. But they're not dying nearly as quickly as the plant life. Oh, it's been 12 hours. Hog. It's official. OPS shows that I've been streaming for 12 hours straight. <laughs> if we want to be technical, it's close to, to like 11 hours. They took an hour and a half or so off for lunch, but you know what? Fuck it. 12 hours. I'm trying to keep going until it's time for me to get the fuck out. Which will probably be eventually, right? Should probably be like soon TM. Let's try and go until we come until we run out the clock on this map. I want to see how much more this game changes. My god. Apparently we missed some things here. Well, we can't let that stand, can we, chap? Gotta clean up our way, our mess. Oh, an evolu- an evolved thunder loop. I never had an evolved thunder loop before. Holy shit. I feel lightheaded. Rifsty, please. I need you to get water. I don't want you to pass out on me. Seriously, Rifsty, you need to get water. You need to drink. Or, cons or eat. Or both. Oh my god! It's the, uh... It's the Grim Reaper. He came 15 minutes early. Asshole. He was like, yeah, you're done. New ch save five, 15 minutes with Papaya, song unlock the song of mana. Survive 15 minutes in Molise, unlock skip. Survive 15 minutes with Papaya. What the hell is skip? Hmm. I know what Skip does. Price per rank allows you to skip level up choices and get experience instead. Oh, that's cool. You got a drink ready. I think you just need a small break from the screen. Yeah, you. it sounds to me like you might be suffering from... Uh, from... Eye fatigue. That's what happens when you stare at a video game or stare at a computer screen for too long. I'll be okay, you need to do your thing again anyway. Okay. As long as you're okay. As for me... Chat. I'm gonna collapse too, really soon. Thank you so much for joining me for our, for, for our longest stream ever. At 12 hours, 12 hours and 4 minutes in fact. We will now find someone to raid. I believe uh, Iceland already suggested after oceans. Are they are they online right now? Let's go see what's going on at their stream. Whoa! What is happening here? Ukulele musician, three D artist. A follower is only chat. I'm tempted to raid them, but at the same time, it's like... It's only a follower is only chat. So, most of y'all would not even be able to speak in there if... Not to mention... 
I would need to follow them myself to see anything. Let's see who else is online before we make the choice. Oh, Grandpa is online too. Last Cody is playing Guilty Meme Strive. Shaughnessy is doing is online and is doing tutorial. Chris is playing Apex and Tatiana is playing is doing just chatting. I haven't seen a lot of these people online in a long time. Villain Legend is doing Final Fantasy XIV and Recoil is doing Doom Eternal. Airdrian is playing Apex as well. Chiggy Flungo is playing Skyrims. Recall is playing Warhammer right now. So many choices, so little. T God, I'm going to pass out. I don't know who to raid now, chat. Think about reading after Oceans, but it's a follower only chat. An intermittent there and an intermission right now. Cooing in five minutes. It so looks like he's off. Going again. Our... Let's go ahead and raid another VTuber. I just don't know who to end with. Honestly. Actually, you know what? Tatiana von Ferdinand is one of the first streamers I ever befriended in bird sight ever. And I never did repay them for the one time they raided my streams. I think it's fitting. Go ahead and raid uh, one of the first YouTubers that I became moots with for my first anniversary. And I'm gonna fucking hurl. Upon the frozen force makes it seem as though it seemed like time has slowed to a crawl. The rustling dry underfoot startles me, interrupting the quiet mood. Someone is approaching me from behind. Hello, Arsnick, welcome to the stream. Oh, son, it's been a while since I've seen you. How you, you doing? Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. May have been eight years since I touched this game. Uh, hi. Do you still Let's get going, Chip. Do you sell? Sell? Sell. You on the flip side. You came? Hesitating. Barely. Yet. As for our read message. I'm for a recognized owner that dainty boy thinks it was. I have felt my heart skip a beat. A voice I've listened to a oh shit! Of times, but never I fucked it up. One second, let me rewrite it. 
I turn this voice, the voice See you, Rip Steep. Thanks again for stopping for chilling with us for the past 12 hours. And now, everyone, please give a warm welcome or a warm hello to Tatiana von Fridanov. They're currently playing Katawa Shoujo, a Channer classic. Wonderful being a VTuber, and I don't think I'll be stopping anytime soon. 